Oh, it's a lot of tournaments. I'm over a lot of tournaments. Come on, Maddie. They have all the tap. They're just so dumb. Yeah, and they're missing two Phoenix. What are you guys too. watching? Uh, it's smite. My, the smite, smite tournament. tournament. So we're watching. Uh, it's the regionals. Maddie, Maddie pockets. Do they the regionals? Do they like, see like it's not regional? Yeah, it is regional. It's How like you, uh northwestern region. Uh, it's N.A. It's N.A., I'll tell you that. It's not no. It's the regionals like that cheerleader movie. Uh, the Up, uh, Bring It On? Yeah. Uh, bring It On, yeah. Yeah, where they participated in Her the the regionals in there. It's cold in here. There must be some clubbers in the, the atmosphere. atmosphere. I say, oi, oi, oi. Spirit I, fingers. I, I, I yeah. bum, 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 that movie was really nah, racist. Nah, nah, nah. Spirit fingers. <laughs> Why? Why is it racist? There was a team of all black chicks, wasn't there? Yeah, that was. Maybe it was they were from an urban area. It's a, it's a, it's <laughs> and then a, it was like the main team. It was, was supposed like, to be like hood <laughs> rich. That's like hood rich. So it was race wars. Yeah, it, was was. Race wars. <laughs> <laughs> it was race wars. It was. It yes, was race wars. Bring it on. Here comes Racing. the newcomers, the Puerto Rican teams. It's just like, uh, what is that? The, the Puerto Ricans, they'll stab each other. Wow, wow. you're racist. Is it like the, uh, right, the, the, the Blue Crush movie, or is it Blue Suburb movie, where it's like the, the, the Michelle Rodriguez is in it? That's Blue Crush. Oh, yeah, yeah, Blue Crush. Blue Crush. Yeah. Doesn't she get knocked chick. the fuck out or something yeah. like that? Yeah, uh, I can't remember. The I've only fucking Spanish one gets knocked the fuck yeah, out. She, no, she and then the white chick an overcomes and... How about yeah, that white! That hey, That's... how about in that Chucky movie when that black guy jumped hey, on yeah, the grenade? Hey, yeah, what's up? God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. The black friend jumped on the by grenade. The way, by the way, uh, Slice asked on the... How are you I didn't paging Dr. Dr. Black time. Friend. <laughs> Please I, jump on this grenade. I, Iron Man 3, uh, Slice cracked. You can see it there in the video <laughs> in the future, hub, guys. Yeah, look at that. I didn't have to do it. Feel free to pause on that frame. Yep. Zoom in and make it your wallpaper. Enhance. And then find out Alex's number. <laughs> hey, they <laughs> lost. <laughs> did you hear what happened to Alex? Nope. He did a video for that the, the, the machine oh, thingy. Set up mm-hmm. for this then. And uh, the, the Xbox. Xbox. Yeah, and uh, um, I guess uh, James tells him, you know what? This will be a good idea. So, no. in one part, like when I go into my room, I see. Well, the no, Xbox. he tells me. Look, he tells me. He what? tells me like, okay. I hey. want you to get a call from me because I guess that. he already shot this prior. Yeah, yeah. He, He's he like, you know. That. I, you need to get like a phone call Does that or mean I'm like stop this? Y- like he, I'm getting a, co- a phone call from I him. Change, I have to uh-huh. change the preference. And I'm supposed to be like kind of midway going oh, up the okay. stairs. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. then yeah, I start going up yeah. the stairs and I get the phone call and he wants me to go to the top and then stand right in the doorway and just kind of like look really shocked at the so Xbox because the Xbox is sitting on my chair. Yeah. So I'm like you know, there's a, you don't know what happened. I was like, what, what signifies that? Like, I get eaten or whatever. I was like, you know, why don't I drop the phone or whatever, and then you can do whatever. Yes. Zoom in on the name. Yeah, yeah, it's a good idea. Like, he's, he's like, he's like, we're going really try hard for this. Like, <laughs> <laughs> he did it, everything. Yeah, it but, was good. I liked it. But yeah, his number showed on there. Yeah, he, he did. dropped it, and yeah. But the way the thing is, like, you actually like for me, like on my giant TV, it's like, really tiny. I, I had to like expand it, flip it, and then zoom in. To see what the fuck it was. Is he getting, like, calls and texts now? Yeah, no, he changed his number already. Oh, wow. But he was like, he was like, uh, when when, when that happened, and then we went to sleep and, like, woke up, I was like, dude, what what happened? He was like, uh... I have a hundred twenty something tech messages. <laughs> oh my god, it's because you're a fucking dumbass. Which song are we using? Never mind. Welcome everyone to Creature Shock for five. 18. Oh, I thought you forgot after you just looked it up over there. <laughs> he was too busy with the oh, rock, rock, rock. <laughs> Well, the, the calendar is up to date. in the grass over here. Calendar's you should up change it slither. one time. Slither, yeah, just slither. fuck it up. Just like put a big question mark and let him like. He'd look at the computer. Then we'll turn it off. Break his computer. Yeah, the computer that records Creed you know Talk, just turn you know, it off. You know what, <laughs> turn, the monitor, just, turn the monitors off, no. and if he turns it on, you stab him. We have like a good old fashioned tape recorder, like right here. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jordan, <laughs> Jordan, what was that new intro song that we just had? Watergate it. Uh, I don't know. It's the one with the Hellboard. Hellberg. Hellborg. 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 Off of this I am JH. He, he did a remix of uh, the. Deadly Premonition. That's, that's the official the Seamus full version because yeah. we had that. I've been using it a little bit. I know. Well, that's I didn't play the entire full version. It wasn't too The music was going on in that video. I was like, dude, stop the music. Cut it off there and then put it. I was like, ah. But I still so, could hear I just had my phone. So, 
we are today joined by the people that are here that'll be here. James. <laughs> we have James. We have Sly. We have Seamus. We have myself. We have Z. <laughs> and we have Dan. Bark. This is this is essentially everybody bought but spoon. spoon. Yep. Yep. This is. Uh, by the way, I saw him yesterday for the first time in like two months. I haven't he seen looks him like since Grizzly I left. Adams. <laughs> I have not seen Spoon since I left. Still Jack Marston. It's just yeah, like I seen Spoon in a while, out of control hair, out of control beard. You know, because and he's, just he's decided like, that he wanted to not just be the normal horse, he wanted to be the Buttweiser horses. The, yeah, the, the Clyde Yeah, the, the, big, but, the Buttweiser the Clyde Sales. Buttweiser. But. He wants to be manly, big, and hairy. Let him and and fluffy. And fluffy. Caveman. At the same time. <laughs> is fluffy really a manly word, though? Fluffy? It's, it's a nice way to call somebody fat. What? That's what that's uh that's actually from a comedian. He uh, yeah I forgot what his name is. Uh, Gabriel Iglesias. Gabe or, Iglesias, or something. Something or? like that. Dane Cook. What was his name? No, not Dane Cook. <laughs> <laughs> it, was like, it was like Gabe. It was like Gabe or something. Dane, Dane Cook is done. <laughs> He's not done. <laughs> he, he had a movie a couple years ago. <laughs> <laughs> he's well, in, he's in that... Planes. He's the main character in Planes, that Disney Cars spinoff. Oh thing. No. are you serious? Yeah, he's the main character. Oh. Yeah. Hey, look, still getting jobs. <laughs> But oh. then yeah, again, that, they that do Carlos, voices for those, like, gonna, years oh, in advance. Look at this! I'm a plane! I don't even know what to do! Propellers! Fuck! Huh? We got turbines! Fuck it! I'm Dave Cook! Huh? Sound like Seinfeld. I don't know. That was like Jerry. What's <laughs> the deal? <laughs> What's the deal with wings? all these planes? <laughs> <laughs> you know, air traffic control... Now he's turning into Bill Cosby. Air traffic <laughs> controllers! <laughs> what? 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 Oh, the God. Oh, man. God. So the Carlos guy is... Is it the guy, the, the, the bigger dude that's always in fucking Ray William Johnson videos? Yeah, 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 that yeah. guy. It's not his. It's not Carlos. It's G Gabriel Iglesias. Gabriel Iglesias. Yeah. Yeah, yep. Oh wow. Gabriel Iglesias. Yeah, yeah. Hot and fluffy. <laughs> Hot. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I just remember because of the Netflix thing. I, I, was like, I, I, <laughs> I like him because he has the ability to change his voice from like normal dude <laughs> to like <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh my god! Like he, he does, does it so mom. well. Yeah. And he always makes that noise like the. And then he switches it like very well. I'm like I like him because he's always he, he he always brings in the racial you know stereotypes. That's that's what I love in a comedian. He's hot and fluffy. <laughs> always <laughs> like a, a sweet. Well, I can relate to like a lot of the things because I actually went there. You're like a you're like a fake Puerto Rican. I'm, <laughs> I'm full yeah. blown. He's a fake you know, Puerto Rican. He doesn't he didn't live the Puerto Rican he's way. Yeah, Rican. when I talk about going over to the fucking you know the the, the graduation party and stealing stuff, he's like, hey, that's straight up Puerto Rican in <laughs> here. No, no, I'm fake. fake. You're fake. fake. Never You're mind. Hey, hey. Faux the, the reason Rican. why I say fake is because one, you don't know the language, and two, I do. You... We should. I'll show you later. Yeah. Uh, well, and video I, uh, that I recorded. Luchador. I, <laughs> I go all out. Are you there? Yeah. <laughs> oh no. 4K. Is there a lot of 4K in there? A lot of. There's okay, a lot money. of no buenos. No, bueno. <laughs> <laughs> no me gusta. <laughs> and no el fuego. fuego. And and. Bola. Uh, culo. And <laughs> what? Really? Bolas. Balls? Yeah. Right. Balls. Agua. Water. Yeah. Yeah. Aki. I, I hit every, Here. every Grande. key point. Big. Yeah. Grande. Me amo. Now we're just saying words. <laughs> right. Hola, senor. You guys, you know what? I take it I take it back. You guys are all. There you go. Luder watermelon o plicks. <laughs> Spanish is fun, so give it a try. Hola is hello. Adios is goodbye. There you go. Oh, man, this that was the intro to a Spanish book. Yeah, I was gonna say it sounded like straight out of a book or like an audio reading or something like that. Really Turn page. Like, what the fuck? I'll turn the page. I'll turn the page. Oh man. Oh god. <laughs> there's some there's some stuff that comedians will bring up where it's like <laughs> it's stuff that they play off as like funny, but it's actually when you think about it, it's stuff that's really depressing. What are you talking like, about? Like they'll be like, you know, my mom cheated on my dad. Whatever. It's like. That's, kind of depressing stuff well, that you're, you're talking you're, about. You're, you're, <laughs> like, you're, you're, looking, that you're looking way too into it. Like, comedy is just supposed to no, be No, like, I'm saying relatable. after, after it's, like, after, after it's said, done, no. and you're like, man, like, that that guy has a really depressing story. No, I see a lot of, like, especially <laughs> over here, I got the first uh, feel of, like, uh, just an all-comedy radio. I never had that in PA, and I love it, but, like, there's some mad depressing shit. And I was actually yeah, talking probably. to Alex with this, Personally, when I watch YouTubers, I, I do like when they do commentaries with specific people. Like, let's say, like, you know, how you and James do stuff or, like, Kutra and C and all that other stuff. Like, I like seeing people doing co-ops a lot more sometimes. Mm -hmm. But I hate it when I see comedy shows 
they have two people talking at the same time. I'm like, shut the fuck up. I just want to hear to that. What, two comedians? Yeah, there was. I think there's there's one that's like two twin brothers. Really? And I just can't get, yeah, they, they talk about it. And, and they just like try to like synergy themselves and the, and the jokes and everything. I'm like, this is, this is not funny. This is Remember funny. when mom cheated on dad? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, we almost what? had a sister. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like. <laughs> <laughs> they start crying. It's like. <laughs> I don't know, but I, I noticed in comedy is like being raunchy and like saying things that people would normally not say. It's like the thing, but if we ever would take that know, path to yesterday, comedy, what when uh, when uh, on the way back uh-huh. from the laser tag thing, uh-huh. listening to Doctor Drew Loveline. Oh yeah, Loveline. <laughs> Loveline. They, they the the the, oh, the topic, no. the open forum of the night was: Is it okay to? To like, I guess sleep with a step sibling or something. And the answer is yes. What? The answer is yes. Ah. This guy came on. <laughs> Biologically, it is. This yeah. Guy, Biologically, I, yeah. 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 Your kids won't come out with problems, but that, does that make it right? Yeah. Doctor Drew is like all <laughs> saying like, no matter what, it's bad. Like it's gonna cause problems and stuff like that. There no was this one guy. <laughs> this one guy came on and he was like, None. he was so happy for whatever reason. Why? And he was just like. Yeah, I slept with my sister's sister. And they're like, they're like, okay, now explain sister. how you know how this came to be. Or wait, 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 wait. Repeat yourself. Your sister's sister. Yeah, that's how he explained. Is <laughs> that your sister? Yeah, but then your sister. Yeah, you dumb piece th- this of is shit. the thing though. He's like, you know, his his mom and dad, I guess, uh, married, had him, right? Uh-huh. And yep. then either his mom or his dad, I think it was his dad, it, it was his dad, Cheated. went back. To his first wife, uh-huh. and had a kid with that wife, uh-huh. and then the child from that, I guess, is what Doctor Drew thought he had slept with. Or he was, he was saying he was like, "That's still your sister." Yeah. He was like, "No, nah, but there's no blood <laughs> you know, or anything sister. like that." He was like, "If if it's your dad, <laughs> like, it's his half sister. It's it's still your blood." And he was like, "You know, you had sex with your 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 half sister." No, man! Doc- like, <laughs> no, wait a minute! Dr. Like, like, <laughs> Doctor, he really station. It might be a prank right now. <laughs> oh like, my god! Is this punked? But then, the action? Action, get out of there! <laughs> he started. He started actually explaining it more, where he was saying, oh like, I guess, uh, uh, that it was it was something different, though. Like, it 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 was like a stepsister to that sister or something oh. like that because the guy didn't explain it right so they were like oh you know you're just no, a dumbass you know, okay. yeah like there's nothing you don't you know, actually but just the guy the guy was like he was like yeah we, 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 it, you know, it's actually kind of fun no, didn't work hi i was playing a clip never mind i did play a clip resume. yeah resume. I, I resume. heard it but you, what yeah, were you playing talk. Everybody was talking. No, it's fine. It's fine. No. We I failed. I failed. I failed at my job. Wow. I should have gotten you guys to stop talking. Yeah, my flow is fucked up. Yeah. Flow is gone. Well, I ruined hey, I'm it. I'm gonna bring it back. I Actually, it. um, I, I had. I'm not gonna tell what specific. Well, let me finish this. Hold on. Go the ahead. guy, the guy was like, even though Doctor Drew like shut him down and said like, you know, he's kind of stupid for saying that. He's like. No, but it's kind of like it's funny because it's like it's like a joke that we use. Uh. And, he, and he's like, like it's only funny like it. It's not funny, like, in general. He was like, the other guy was being a smartass, and he was like, boy, I, I'm so glad that we have the world's greatest comedians here on Love Line. <laughs> and, like, he, he was like, yeah, I mean, we go to parties, and we have fun with it and stuff like that. <laughs> it's just like, All what right. the fuck is wrong with you? Like, you have fun <laughs> with this kind of thing. By the way, this, this, just a big head up. This might be a really ranty creature talk. and I, I wanna Randy. Say, we'll get ranty. to that. We'll get to that. Yeah, there's a lot of rant talk. There's a lot of rant notes here. Yeah. <laughs> but actually, just before we drop on that, I actually know I have a friend that, uh, his, like, his mother had, a uh, went with another husband or whatever, and, uh, the dude actually had sex with, the. Uh, the deuce, the the father's daughter. You know, he's like, I don't give a fuck, cause the half sister. Yeah, I'm like, it's just like, and like one of my step dudes, sister, or half sister. That would be half sister if they had a kid. If they had, no, did yeah, they have a, a kid? She, or it was they, it, this was like introduced, like it was like so it's through marriage, yeah, not blood. Yes, that's yeah. step. Oh, okay. step. Yeah, so step like in, yeah. so like he was telling me he was like so proud of it. I remember my one friend was always. <laughs> He was, because she was really attractive, she, the girl was really attractive. Uh-huh. That's but most of the that people makes in okay. love line when they say they're like, "Man, we were 13 and she was so hot." Like, <laughs> they, they, at least for me, like I'm not related. I'm like, yeah, she's attractive, but doesn't mean like you're gonna have. This is your 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 sister. Like, I'm for I, it, actually. You know, all for it. All right. You no, know, I've slept with all of my sisters, <laughs> all zero of them. 
<laughs> oh god. <laughs> Did you kill him after you had sex with him? That's why, not here. That's why he has zero now. Uh, yeah, I, zero. <laughs> I was like, you can't tell my secret. And now I just told my secret. So he I'm kills fine. him and then eats him so he can get stronger. There was that wasn't that. even, no, I didn't even mention that. You're just putting your own twist on this tail. Wow, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're, you're putting words into his mouth. He I, claimed I that he's murdered like his sister, like he but he didn't eat him. He's not sick. I didn't, uh, I'm not sick. I have I have moral boundaries here. <laughs> Cannibal, cannibalism is not yours. Not yet. Give it a decade or so. When I'm starting to feel, you know, a little bit bored and I'll start eating people. Uh-huh. You gotta give it some time to grow. Okay, there was this other chick that came on and this it was funny because this chick it completely turned around on her. Like oh. she was looking for advice and they ended up shitting on her. She <laughs> called like in one. She called in and said for Cinco de Mayo, which I'm assuming, you know, she's Spanish. Uh-huh. She sounded kinda of Spanish, but she was saying like for Cinco de Mayo, she's like, I get really horny when I drink tequila. She was like <laughs> I was asking she was asking her fiance Mm-hmm. For a threesome with his cousin, she cu- wanted a threesome with her fiance. So and his wait, is the cousin so, a boy or so? A girl? It was a man witch to to is, to is, allow me say a cousin can be a girl. Oh, okay. No, it was a dude. It was a dude. <laughs> oh, okay, it was well, a dude. What no, can no you yell at me, please, more? Because no, she said a she explained point. you can be a girl <laughs> as a cousin. I have cousins that are girls. I haven't slept with them yet, but I might get there. She <laughs> killed them yet. She just explained <laughs> it. You know that you know she gets horny when she's on tequila, and she wanted two men at the same time. Damn. So she wanted she wanted um, to fill the fiance she needed one and more. and the cousin, and then she said like that he Ooh. wasn't for that he he didn't want to do it. I wonder why. Then the next yeah, day I mean, he said you know because she begged him. She said, she was like, I begged him to do it, and he was like, no. And the next day, he was like, you know, if you really want to, we'll get him to do it. Damn, that dude is That's whipped. dedication. Then wow. they, did it. Is whipped, they like, did it. They did it. And the guy, uh, she said that her fiancé didn't do anything during the, like, the threesome. Like, he couldn't perform during the threesome, and that it was all the cousin. And <laughs> she was saying, like, you know... <laughs> I kind of wanted to leave him for the cousin. She was saying that, like, you know, no. it's all good now, or whatever, all past it. They were like, you know, your fiancé isn't past it. Because she was saying that now he can't perform oh, in at, general. Oh, holy yeah. shit. And she, they, Dr. Drew was really pissed. He was like, <laughs> you just fucking sabotaged this relationship. Oh. And she was like, no, 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 I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she, <laughs> she was like, no, 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 I didn't. Like, he was like, what? you did. He was like, she was like, well, me and the cousin got over it. He was like, yes, yeah, you guys yeah, got wow. over it. He was oh like, my God. your fiance is not going to get over it. He was like, because they've were they been together for five years, he said. Wow. And it was like, you hey, sabotage that here relationship. Yeah, I, I have a five-year relationship. Give me a second. I'm throwing this in the garbage. Yeah, where's your trash can so I can throw my relationship <laughs> But she would not. she would not fucking realize that she, like, Sabotage that she was just like no no I mean and she kept laughing and Dr. Drew was like it's not funny <laughs> he was like it's it's really not funny he was like you you just like you know sabotage the relationship and you you know shadow in the sky. Mm. She now, give it now, the cousin, now, now that we're talking, this is apparently the random filler area that we're talking about. So, <laughs> it's a love line. Yeah, no, I, actually, um, I was I was going through Tumblr and I seen this post about I I never watched. I think it's Nightmare Kitchens. Oh, yeah, I've seen that. Nightmares Nightmares awesome. Oh, you're yeah, talking about the crazy chick? Uh, yeah, Amy's With, Bakery. Oh All right, my so God. i never seen somebody in so much fucking denial. Like, Is this the Chef Ramsay one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, like, tries to, be, he, like, goes into yeah, restaurants awesome. and tries to fix them up if they have yeah, problems. Yeah, and, like, th- this was the first f- the first time that he could not fix... Oh, the one that he fixed up the he fixed up the restaurants. Yeah, yeah like, yeah. it's, it's uh, like, kitchen really bad. Like, yeah, but know. he has, like, he has, like, two or three different shows where he has, yeah, like, yeah. Well, kitchen like, night night. This one specifically and, made me, like, I'm like, <clears throat> I can't believe this actual people like that they in the were world. so bad like the owner would take the tips from the from the, the waitresses yeah and stuff. he would take he the, would keep the waitress. Uh, <laughs> there was this one part where where like like there's only one person cooking which is amy like the wife and whatever she and, cooks everything and she cooks everything there's like a shit ton of items in the menu which is kind of stupid if only you only have one person also they have uh girls that you know deliver the food and whatnot but the, the only person that's allowed to touch the cash register because he doesn't trust anybody is the <laughs> husband in it and he got really mad oh my god there was this one point where these two dudes ordered a pizza and never get anything and he goes say hey you know we've been waiting for quite a bit and he's like no if you don't like this you can go fuck yourself and get out and they didn't buy anything and when they were leaving he was like no you're not gonna leave you're gonna pay for it and i'm like pay for what there was like water on that table maybe like they (laughs) made pay for that water it was so. It was like I this one seventy five for it, that it, water. I think it's called, and it's like this. This lady apparently is like so bad. It's like, she's nuts. She no, like she's like legitimately in like in like 
She was denial. like, I speak cat. Like, meow, she meow, is meow, a, meow. She's like the mayor of denial. Like, and it's like the episode's called Amy's Bakery, and it's <clears throat> Amy's Bakery's in Bristol, and it's just so bad. It just made me cringe. Like, the dude was like, like, he actually... What did uh, Chef Ramsay say when he uh, got uh, there? Oh, well, he, he, <laughs> he got a whole out. bunch of beeps. Uh, oh, no, a no, whole no. bunch of beeps. No, no, he didn't cringe at all. He was trying... <laughs> he actually was really shocker. relaxed at first. He was like, oh, wow, this place looks nice. Like, first of all, in the in the beginning, she had, like, a big display of all these cupcakes and cakes and all these other shenanigans. And I'm like, first of all, seeing from the previous thing they show, this girl does not know how to cook for shit. It does not look like it. And also, I actually even went even deeper and I went to her Facebook and a lot of people start deeper investigation listen 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 listen, listen, listen. you guys are cutting me off private eye sly Jesus Christ oh we should do a series called private sly where sly watches a TV show and then investigates the people after listen listen. no it's not her personal Facebook it's her shop Facebook okay it's her shop Facebook and she would post like hey I cooked this delicious brownie with ice cream and she what she does she steals images from other places and calls it her own. Oh, pretty good. Oh, wow. So now that that's why I investigated because I just character I, investigation. Funny. It was funny. It was that funny. Is funny. I, was I can imagine you know those 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 prison reality ones where like they cut it off and they just have the text where it says like you know later this guy on. was sentenced to you know thirty years or whatever and then have Sly look up look him up and be like where'd they go after the thirty years when they got out of prison like dude, where'd they go? Dude, uh, this be, man was out on that works eight. at a Kmart a private eye. for good okay. behavior. But private Sly. But she steals pictures from people. And she claims that it's her own. So I knew I the That's whole, pretty smart. The I'd cakes that. were were obviously. She probably did. just go to the Betty Crocker yeah, site. Yeah, I've been thinking about taking some of your Minecraft videos and putting on my channel. You should do like I should take all my Minecraft dailies. You have almost two hundred episodes. Yeah. That, that, that's a lot. Yeah, I do like ten a day and have yeah. enough for a while. Fuck you. That'd be pretty good. <laughs> but on top of that, like it, it was just like apparently the husband. Anytime that they would send food back, the husband would tell the lady that like the bus girls throw it away. She would he would never tell his wife that the customers were upset with it. And then when uh, she started cooking for for Chef Ramsay, mm. uh, he ordered like ravioli and the yeah, like a pizza like, too. Yeah, yeah, and a pizza and everything. And, like they were like, yeah, these raviolis were fresh made and everything. Chef boy already. If they were frozen, the dude's like, the dude, Ramsey took them like, this is your ravioli? Are you serious? He goes outside to everybody eating in the restaurant. Guys, I you guys are eating, eating <laughs> fucking frozen ravioli. They're telling you this is like fresh made and like his pizza, like it was burnt underneath of it, but it was still dough in the oh, middle. Man. It was like really dough. And, and yeah, she, yeah, every, yeah. Time, every time that he would go with like, he was like, you know that this is wrong. She's like. I don't know. This would never happen. All my customers say it's fine. This is all good. I, they always love my pizza. I get all these reviews. And then she's like, you know what's going on? Bloggers. Bloggers are ruining what? this. What? They, they, People are that are internet, searching up my they, shop they, like this guy. They're internet bullies. <laughs> no, but like internet bullies. You're part of the problem. You're the internet bully right <laughs> I, now. I haven't commented. I hope she doesn't hear this. How dare you leave a I truthful don't, I don't, If I don't have anything nice to say, I'll still say it. But... Uh, that would be awesome if she did. We get fucking mentioned by a celebrity. Get her on this show. Chick that got bitched out by Chef Ramsay. Yeah, she can close enough to food. Chef Ramsay. Yeah, I mean, we're good to but go. But like, it, like that episode stuff, you can find it. It's in YouTube. They have it's in, it's in two parts. It is the most cringing thing. It's Amy's Bakery and, and it's thingy. Like Amy something. Yeah, and it's, it's just, on like, Facebook. And, and, and like she's like at one point she's like, oh, and like they're sitting and they're talking. Her talk, personal profile. They're, they're talking to to her and they're like, oh. And, uh, she's talking to Ramsey's like, oh, I have three kids, but they're stuck in cat form. And then she goes, yeah. Yeah, she said she like speaks cat and she starts meowing. She's like, I speak feline. Meow, 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 meow. See? She, she's, she was she's nuts. A, she's a bagger. You know she's she a was, bag of she's like, she was like Jordan in 20 years. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And like, I the never, cat whisperer. Like, you know, when you see kids in denial, it's an ad- a grown adult in denial, and it's the most. Yeah, you're gonna you're gonna be thing. that dude that's in the home just like going, mew, mew. <laughs> you know, like, this yeah. fucking guy over here, like <laughs> the guy that nobody wants to. You don't want to play checkers with you. No, he's chess. Like I don't want to do anything with you because <laughs> all you do guy. is fucking meow. We think he eats cat food too. <laughs> <laughs> We should do a creature talk without topics once, just to this see how long This is what this has turned into. We have gone almost half an hour without wow. even touching on a topic. Okay. Yeah. Well, like, I like, it's I like most I creature like talks. Like, yeah, it is like most yeah, creature talks. <laughs> that? uh, oh, that's that, that thing right there. That oh my god, that's gonna like fall and hit you on the head. I think it just it's did. been pretty stable <laughs> for now since they put it up. Mm-hmm. Right? Oh, no, it makes it makes the house smell less shitty. So, that so that thanks for joining uh, Chef Ramsay Kitchen Night. Chef Ramsay talk topic <laughs> and creature love line. Uh, okay, so <laughs> hitting our topics. Let's get to the topics now. After you know a half hour, technically a half hour pre-show. 
Um, Star Trek Into Darkness. <laughs> Star Trek Into Darkness. <laughs> we, <laughs> and now everybody's thoughts watch. <laughs> we, should, oh, no. we should start a show where we give people sex advice. It'd probably be the worst show ever and the worst advice ever, but man, it would be funny. Write it down. <laughs> oh, Creature <there's> sex <laughs> show. Oh, no. But like, listen, man, I know you... You know they got those vibrating rings that you put around. Yeah, no, you know what you do is like, you know, I'm an expert on vibrators. Did you see the Vegas short where I pulled the vibrator out, out of my ass? ass. <laughs> I've been sent a number of dildos. They come in all shapes and forms. I can tell you which one would be a best fit for you. We should do murder talk with Seamus. Oh, yeah. uh, That's yeah. like to murder murder how talk. to hide a body. How to cook <laughs> your, how to cook your human meat. Creature. Creatures give you life advice. <laughs> Set your oven on 350 degrees. All right. So Preheat a little bit. What are you doing? I'm looking at topics that people are tweeting at me. Oh, because oh. we need more, more apparently. Yeah, we, need more topics. <laughs> we need more than the eight Man. we already have. All right. so, yeah, we had to see Star Trek Into Darkness. Yeah, uh, so the, the movie trip you is up now. Why did I say that to James? I punched James. Why? Because I chased he was it out being of immature. I was gone. And he's wearing he's a, he's an old he's costume. He's a fan. James hates going to these, so he he voluntarily got punched by Coots. Yep. I don't like movie nights. They're terrible. <laughs> <laughs> you would have enjoyed the amount of Simon Pegg in that movie. You yeah, there was a lot of. I'll Simon probably Pegg. see it eventually. But there was a lot of Simon Pegg. Yeah, yeah. There was a lot more Simon Pegg than the first one. You were upset about it. You're like, oh, it's gonna be like maybe like ten seconds. Yeah, Simon well, Pegg Dan promised like... him like this grand yeah. yeah. Simon yeah. Pegg in the well, first movie. Well, I forgot how little he was in it. Like I was just like, <laughs> oh. I wasn't focusing just on Simon <laughs> Pegg when I watched the movies before. He that. only had like probably three minutes total. In yeah, yeah. He had like five or six jokes, and then he was gone. <laughs> it was pretty sad. Yeah, he, probably, he had a lot of jokes. He in this probably one. got a hefty check out. But more so, I'm just wait. I'm waiting for the new fucking like Ed, Edgar Wright one, like the yeah, yeah, yeah. final in the trilogy World's first. End. Yeah, might as well wait for that first. Indeed. Good. But uh, Star Trek Into Darkness, we did a movie night on it. The video's up on the hub, and uh, we yeah we went and saw both Star Trek movies. They had a. Uh, the commercials they had in front of it were oh kind God. of like the, the for the first movie they Did had they like do a, cool commercials for that they had like the VCR interactive Star Trek game from like the nineties <laughs> oh, yeah. and, would... and they had like fan made films oh, too so cut they, they, they they had, like, the, what would happen the is would, yeah, would, <laughs> would families would oh go in I don't know where this was they go in and sit on a green screen and then they green screen them into this like preset uh, like bridge for the Enterprise and they'd read off a script and it was just <laughs> awful and they have like real Klingons talking to them but they're like not looking directly at them because they're green screened in yeah it was a little so kid dark. green screened in the space of where like it, yeah it that's, like, that's like that's like the previews hilarious. for painting game were like really cheesy like really? that that's but like fun, Gatsby wasn't anything special it doesn't matter Gatsby was legit yeah. it was more like a history lesson yeah for they had F Scott, F Scott Fitzgerald like documentary stuff but um for the like second Iron movie, before the second movie started, they had like Shatner doing Rocket Man and Rocket, Rocket Man. Man. Rocket, <laughs> Rock it, man. man. Jordan was like, we should do a video on the Creature Hub with uh, us doing like some different modern popular, song. like newer. He was like, call me, maybe. Just call me, <laughs> maybe. And we, and we were talking about Gangnam number. Style. Oh, my God. oh, oh, hey, sexy lady. <laughs> oh, <but. laughs> Gangnam what? Style. Wow. Should do uh, like a just a short for every like uh, like an upcoming movie or whatever, and just send it to them and see if they'll play it. In yeah, dude, movie. you could be, <laughs> be, like, be the biggest. We thing. can make something pretty fucking cheesy. Just throw it in there with the rest of the cheesy shit, <laughs> and, and we'll be in the audience watching, be like, yeah, 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 this is us. Awesome. We all stand up. It's yeah, like, like, hey guys, yeah, 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 Dan yeah. comes and walks in. Go, Dan! Yeah, I heard my dude. Yeah, I, I would be so. Kind of like you walked into the dark night with your bane. Where did you walk in with your bane outfit? And you got a you got a little bit of a. Reaction. It was it was the Dark Knight Rises. The dark you really? can't do that anymore though. Like we went yeah we went for the triple feature thing where they showed all three movies and the first and last time that was yeah that was, that was the same night the the shooting happened in Aurora and and then God. after that AMC changed their policy for costumes and I mean you can still That's wear sad. costumes you just can't wear masks. Even though people in the fucking yeah. Iron Man were, were having Yeah, there was a guy shit. who had a mask, so... Fuck he up. wasn't wearing it, though. He just kind of was showing it off, and he put it on for, like, pictures here and there. Yeah, I could do that. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. You uh, hear me? How weird. James is upset. But I'm yeah. so upset. I'm so always upset. This is why I don't want to go to the movies anymore. God. Anyway, this is why we have fun costumes. hurting you, <laughs> so you can't Do you know how much time and effort gets put into these costumes that I put together? It's fucking... Yeah, I know how much money plot. goes into these costumes. <laughs> Crafted with these hands. <laughs> yeah, and a credit card. <laughs> That's on that table right now. <laughs> yeah, it's it right next to James. Right I, just, I just buy it. <laughs> <laughs> He's got Amazon up on his phone. He's ready to buy some more. Oh, it's over here. Superman. Phaser. See that phaser, man. Yeah, that phaser I shot James with. That was part of the... It was set to stun. 
He went out and Not bought anymore. it. Not anymore. Well, Jordan's dead. <laughs> <laughs> and you charge it. Yeah. I didn't even see that shit. I was fucking with Hidden that. features on there. I was like... Easter eggs. <laughs> <laughs> or they just the wanted to have the other primary this? color Call on Duty? there. Oh, yeah. yeah. The There's an Avenged Sevenfold yeah. song that plays if you, <laughs> <laughs> if you hold it on. I don't move here. They're talking to move here. There's an Easter egg for you. Anyway, Jordan and Pretty Seamus good. and I really like Star Trek. Uh, I thought it was darkness. one of the better movies I've seen in a good while. My family was like freaking out about it. I was getting texts. I see such like, mixed just saying, things like, about it though. It felt like half a movie to me. I felt like really? half a movie. Well, half a movie. I was saying kind of the it, same cause, thing. Because I saw like I saw your guys as a. Uh, Thing about it, like wrapping up really quickly, and I yeah, totally agree yeah. with that. And yeah, just felt like yeah, half. A, was, like, I felt like half thing. a movie because of that. I didn't expect the ending coming up so it quickly. Should, they should have just stretched out the end a little bit more and given a little bit. I mean, there was plenty of closure and everything. It was just that they wrapped it up so quickly yeah, after the climax. Really, like, All right, guys, low budget. Go, go, close it up. Let's go. I well, I mean, it seemed like they had more, but they edited it to. Is not the statement that it's that good for a JJ film, but kind of uh, for a Star Trek thing? Well, here, my Is family, because my family. My sister, my brother, um, the I'm huge Star Trek fans. We're all huge Star hey, Trek oh, fans. Feels good. Yeah, Are you cold? cold? My sister, my sister said it was one of the best movies she's ever seen. Yeah, I like. My a lot. brother fucking loved it. Like, really, really loved it as a Star Trek movie. So, like, as a Star Trek movie, I thought it was really good. I wouldn't say yeah. it's like the best Star Trek movie. Well, I thought the I thought the movie was really good. I was like, oh my god, this movie's amazing. And all of a sudden, yeah. the ending just crept up to me. I was like, wait, it's over. Exactly. Yeah. Well, it's like, should, have had, should have had a grander ending and should have had a little extended bit more. cut for the DVD release. Well, it seemed oh. like they wrapped it up really quickly because there's a part where Kirk is giving a speech and like it's, it's it seems dubbed and they don't really show his mouth moving a whole lot and like it seemed like there should have been more there and it just was weird, but. Yeah. Maybe they couldn't get what's his face to come back to finish his like monologue and they were just like, you know, fuck it. Sure. Let's throw it in there. Spock. Throw it in what, there. Nimoy? Huh? The Nimoy or the newer Spock? Quinto. No, didn't you say it was Or Kur- Yeah, you said Kirk. Pet didn't you? Pine, Chris yeah. Pine. Yeah. That would be yeah, Chris no, no, Pine. It was weird. He but. moved on to another project or something. Like <laughs> he hit his voice he hit his acting allowance that was on his contract because he yeah. used up all his lines in the game. Like, oh I was, god! I was commissioned to do this many lines. I used up this much lines in well, the let's, game. Let's see. Now this. you only have five lines left. <laughs> I wonder if he was as lazy as Norman Reedus in the fucking. two hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> was he as lazy as Norman Reedus in the fucking? No, they survival? actually they weren't too bad. No? no, but okay, I'd say compared to the Star Trek game, the movie is the best thing ever made. Yeah, that game is pretty. Well, perfect. you're comparing the game, which has like a thousand oh, and one we were, glitches. That was t- me and so him many were glitches. Just also has a thousand and, and one like users online. If, we if even that, it. it's just dragging. <laughs> we're like, oh, yeah. come on. What game was bad? It was adding time to our playthrough. Yeah. Uh, yeah, like the one where we were running around circles, and then we just kind of popped on the ceiling and then fell into space. What? <laughs> we just like floated down. We went through a ca- like a model of a ship and stuff terrible. like that. It was uh, terrible. It was terrible. I've seen a video just dedicated to all the glitches and like the AI is really bad. Like, uh, it's not the good. captain's like running to a wall. He's like, "I'll follow you." Yeah, we had a character because we were playing co-op, but there was a character who was supposed to be following us, and there's a part where she's running into a wall. Yep. And- that's just bad. Bad. I, I got to a spot where we were fighting like a boss and I ran around a corner and I just got stuck and I was running in a place and I was like, I'm coming, Dan, just wait. Yeah. I just sat there just running and running and running. <laughs> what it kind of do bosses anything. do they have? In there, there was a boss fight where we like crazy overpowered it. It seemed like it was supposed to be hard, but like its health bar went eh, eh, yeah, eh, yeah, and then went, like, went straight down. Yeah. But what were, what were we saying? I said, what kind of bosses do they even have in there? They're all like variations of Gorn. They're like dinosaur kind of creature things. What the he, hell? The they have different is, classes. Uh, but... Carl Urban actually mentions Oh yeah, there's a reference to the, the game, game in the movie. In the movie. There's a reference to the game he, in the movie. Right in one of the in one of the scenes, hmm. he he says Carl Urban over the radio is like, "Oh yeah, I just had to give a C-sec emergency C-section to a Gorn that was pregnant that attacked us, and man, those little buggers can bite or something like that." Same exact line and in then the movie. He, in the movie, he's like, "Yeah, one time I had to give a C-section to a Gorn, and it had." Octuplets and those things can bite or something. Like yeah, that. wow. It was so it was I like, was like, that's from the they game. Had a, that was something that was kind of cool. Oh, they put that in there for oh, you. Yeah, yeah. 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 And you were like, yeah, it's so worth it. Now at the end of the day, it's worth it because they had, they had a bunch of references in the movie. They had, they had. So you were like Captain America. You were like, I get that reference. His own personal flying monkey. I do not understand. I do. Yeah, I get that reference. I but get oh that God. reference. Anyway. <laughs> That's what you were doing. That's funny. Good job, Coots. Yeah. And Nolan North, which... Nolan North is in it. I remembered when I saw him in the credits, because I think it was James that had seen it on his IMDb, and we were 
looking forward to it. I completely forgot about it, and then I saw him in the credits, and I was like, oh, I, I think I knew who it was, but I, I couldn't remember exactly. Every and day, I went back and saw Every him. day, about 15 new items get added to <laughs> Nolan North's IMDb. <laughs> <laughs> It is unpredictable where you will find he, him next. He's a big boy. He's like there was, Waldo. There was a, he had retweeted, Nolan North had retweeted somebody who said, you know, is Nolan North a bad guy in the new Star Trek movie? He goes, not a bad guy, just following orders. And I was Whoa. like, okay. He's, he's wow. in like, he's in one shot. You see him in one shot, just on the, on the Vengeance, the USS Vengeance. Keep an eye out on the bridge for the bridge crew because he's like standing behind a console. And then he has one line later. What does he I can't, say? I can't remember what his line was, but it was like. Man, was can you imagine if he eventually like, becomes like a big ass <laughs> or something? Like that. That'd be fucking re- what? what the <laughs> hell? Nolan the Uncharted movie, movie. He just like Nolan North just just gets like you know he's getting like little he, jobs he, here he, and there in movies, he's, but he's he gets like up. he's like building up. Main he's role just, or something like this, that. He's gonna cash in all those little roles for a big role. I have no idea. Okay. I was just seeing a few. Movies Would you guys cast him as your as, as your cast as him as anything? As a star? Yeah, anything like, that I'll would cast star him as my father to have him here at the creature house. Every fucking part would go to him. Mr. North. Though. Actually, no, it'd One. be divided half Blum, half <laughs> him. So oh, okay. Blum if we could get them both, they still have to yeah. talk to each other. So yeah. like, just talk to themselves. Can I get somebody that I like that? No. Could we? Who? If we had Metal Gear, Hideo Kojima. Hey, David. Hey, could you imagine if we had Hater? Hater. Hater. David Hater. Yeah. It'd be amazing if we had Nolan North and Steve Blum sitting at a table with microphones, have a camera, them just talk for a little bit. I would just, just about voice acting in so just many like games. Just like you hear our whispers, it's like, do Wolverine and Deadpool. Go, 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 go. It's like, it's like, act like you're fighting. Deadpool. Yeah. Act what like you you're want, at a Wolverine? birthday party or something. Some characters. Come on. Do, do, do Mafia 2. Mafia 2. <laughs> <laughs> like talk to like yourself, Nolan North. I like David yeah. Hyder or Hater. I don't know how to really pronounce it. Hi, Hater. Hi, Hyder. He would probably be more expensive than fucking no, Nolan Blum no, combined. I think, actually, actually, no, not. I think actually that not. would be true. You know what? No, because uh, you know that one channel that I'm really... Uh, that I'm a fan that I met uh, at PAX East? Uh, his name is Jay, and they're from 3 Kilobytes. Mm, I uh, saw they're, it, they're located in Canada, and... Uh, they got a they got him in the show and like the channel's not really that humongous but they he's like down to like help people. How do you know if they don't have like a connection or something? I'm like gonna talk to. I'm Jay. sure they had to pay for that booking gonna, at some point. We don't want him. What? No one cares about him. Okay. <laughs> Everyone cares about Nolan North and okay. Steve Blum. Okay. Well. Fuck, okay. Fuck, yeah. fuck whatever I like again. Crawl back into your hole. David Hater. Yeah, here. All right, fuck it. All right, I'll David Hater's claim to fame is is one role. <laughs> Steve Blum no, I, hey, is wait, wait, so wait, 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 wait. David just, Hater uh, wrote the screenplay for, for Watchmen. And for X-Men and X-Men 2. What? Yeah, for X-Men and X-Men 2. He was a great So he's a little bit more diverse. They're damn sure better than fucking Last Stand. So, I mean. Yeah, he did the first two, and uh, he did Watchmen. He's a little bit did. more diverse than I gave him credit for. But I'm still... Steve Blum right. and Nolan North. The way Nolan oh, wow. North can change his voice, it's unbelievable. What did, what did he all do? Uh, X-Men Scorpion King. Oh, <laughs> never mind. He's going down now. <laughs> <laughs> which one? Wait, which one? Was, which one? Which one? Yeah, what, the, the first Scorpion <laughs> King. <laughs> which one? All of them were terrible. What are you talking about? <laughs> hey, hey. I, li- I, can't, I, can't, I don't care. I don't care what you guys say. I like the first one. James is gone. Yeah, I, like I like the first one. I liked the first one the first time I saw it. I went back and watched it and recently. I, it's not good. Yeah, James is gone. James when is I watched back. it when I was young, I liked it, yeah. all right? Which one? <laughs> Fuck you guys. The second one's so much better than the first one. It really depends on which one. He's recently, but it's nothing. Oh, man. There's like five well, of them, hey, too. He has, he has a good chunk of shit done. Like, he's, he's pretty noticeable out oh, there. Come on. It's cool. <laughs> I did not, by the way, to my knowledge, I did not know that he did Scorpion King. Or maybe I blanked out. Yeah, it seems the last it. ten years of work has all been Metal Gear. Ah. That's, that's fine. Of Knights of the Old Republic. Are you he, serious? He played yeah, Jedi Knight, Knight Male. Male. You, don't think, you don't think those X-Men movies are good? I like them. But that's what he's known as. He's known as the voice of fucking Snake, which he won't even be known as that for, for you know, yeah. soon because they, they replaced him. Either way, I still like him. He's getting phased out. Uh, he's getting phased out. He's going to have to so retire gonna, like Hideo. He's hey, going to have to gonna, retire. It's done. It's <laughs> done. He's out. <laughs> okay, so anything else about Star Trek? You'll never Good see movie. anybody phase Z- out. Z- no one will phase out Nolan North or. Uh, I pretty much said what I need I to believe. say. Yeah, I can't really, I can't really say much without like actually spoiling yeah, it. Yeah, that's what you said the same thing in our video. It's, it's, it's it's, there's some issues I had with it, but I would have to spoil it. So. Yeah, after the last. <laughs> I could talk. Know, I could talk to you guys about it after. I guess. Yeah. All right, after good. I talked about some guy playing a piano in a movie and totally called whatever the hell it was, and that was cried spoiler alert. I actually asked why that was written on the board. Oh, I had the shirt. I didn't understand it. 
like, and they they refreshed me on that, and I was like, okay, I, I completely <laughs> forgot about that. The shirt of like the piano. Him with the thing. piano. Okay, oh. so now, if the past hour of talking about Chef Ramsay and then Star Trek Into Darkness was not enough, we were about to get into and Nolan oh, North and God. Steve Blum and Nolan North and Steve Blum and that other scrub that he's. Fuck you! Oh, this is gonna be the next hour. Oh. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was leading I up had, to. I <laughs> actually, I, I mentioned this. Uh, me and Alex went into a big discussion about that. What is the topic? The topic is Nintendo being dumb. That's okay. what I wrote. <laughs> but that's, what, that's what I wrote. <laughs> that's, what, <laughs> that's what Dan wrote. What it Nintendo is is Nintendo. Uh, if if anyone didn't know this, Nintendo recently. Uh, it I don't know how long ago it was when it they was like a visit, got a partnership in February. Yeah, yeah. just uh, recently it kind of became known that Nintendo started doing third-party claims on all pretty much most of their videos, um, which are content ID matches. Yes. which means which means that they get the revenue from the videos. So um, they get all the money that's produced off of the video. Yeah, all the work if that it's, we put if it's a Nintendo, it, yeah, all the work that much. we put on the video. Claim. So before we start with our perspective, yeah. because I've gotten like I would I would say a few things on Tumblr, and I would get every every like a few I, messages <laughs> like someone would be like, "Man, you're so biased towards you Nintendo." Said, you said I heard what I, I showed shame as a tweet I got. Some, oh, some yeah. kid was like, "Wow, you're you're so dumb. You should really do your research before you look." <laughs> yeah. Don't jump at the first yeah. rumor. Don't jump in at the it's first like, rumor. That this comes isn't out. what we've been doing for the for the past yeah, like, don't know five years or so. Like, what? Oh, so Nintendo's official statement. Was was something along the lines of we are kind this was after all after the tweets. all the tweets that people were sending out about how dumb they're being their their response was that in you know it was we are being nice and letting you guys keep yeah. these videos up and just claiming the ad revenue from them and not throwing copyright trying to make it seem them. like they're the good guys they're, yeah they're like, making it seem at like at least we're letting you post it kind yeah, of yeah yeah exactly the last legitimate copyright strike i've ever gotten was from rockstar in like I don't know, whenever Red Dead Redemption came out, whatever that's year that exactly was, that was like the last legitimate yeah, That's exactly I what I gotten. tweeted. I was like, even Rockstar has come around to the fact that this is they a have completely something mutual, like, mutual like, beneficial relationship between mm -hmm. LPs and companies. They released like a this. statement on their website. They're like, you know, we don't really mind LPs. Just, yeah. you know, don't just upload the cutscenes via yeah. commentary. And it's yeah, like, yeah, do it yeah. from beginning to end yeah. and yeah. stuff like that. I mean, they, they have like... They're they're not as strict as what they want. Oh, they were part, terrible. You know what though? Part of, me, really part of me feels that, and I've been like looking into this a little bit again. The spy sly, uh, even though it's just information. Spy sly. Spy sly. Private, private sly. sly. Private sly. Private sly. Saving private sly. Private uh, sly. <laughs> I noticed that, and I think it, it was like apparently for the month, uh, the previous month, I guess the Wii U sold twenty thousand less units compared to the Wii. And that I, was just recently that yeah, they, yeah, they posted it, that. Yeah, and I, I'm like, I'm the wondering. The Wii U that sold less than the Wii. And I'm wondering, <laughs> like, it's like, what I'm wondering is, like, are they getting mad let, thirsty with the let, 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 let me just sales? Let me just highlight something. One, Nintendo is pulling out of pretty much every major press like related thing at E3. They're not doing a they're not, they're not doing a conference, right? they're not really doing a big booth or anything. You know they're, what they are doing? <laughs> wait, wait for <laughs> that. What, hold hold, hold wait, 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 wait. I was just saying that this was this was just announced not too long ago where <laughs> they're doing their E3 is at Best Buys around. Oh, I seen that! I seen that! <laughs> what? I seen oh, that! Oh my no. god! They have, oh, they have unplay like you know like like playable builds of unreleased games yeah. at select Best Buys Why? during E3, E3. Yeah. during E3 weekend. This is their E3. Oh my god. Okay, so there's well, that. Well, I'm thinking, I'm thinking the way that thing is like, well, more people get to go to Best Buys around the world than fuck E3. Oh, yeah, that's like, I, countless, I don't go to Best Buy. Like, countless ever. publishers are saying they are not developing anything for the week. Yeah, EA. Did you EA. see the, the retweets I, someone did? Yeah, let's see. That engineer, like EA <laughs> or whatever He said that we use poop. And that really? Not gonna <laughs> he's, like, he's like, FIFA sold so poorly, we're not going to do a new FIFA for the Wii U. We're not going to do the new Madden. Like, we have oh, no games. Oh, He's like, we have no games in development. Anything. I seen that the, the the you know the the the, the title like the header saying EA doesn't. But I mean, I, I said that when we when we were over there at fucking E3, I was like, I mean, it seems really good and all. Like, for what they're producing for it right now, like there's some cool like mechanics within stuff like that. But no one's gonna want to fucking no. develop for this. Yeah. Like, it's gonna be it's like, too like complicated. You said, a mini map or an inventory. If thing. the PS3 hardware wise is too complicated for like a good bit of developers <laughs> to like, a Nintendo handle. with a separate screen. Yeah, a Nintendo how is that gonna be easier? With, you know, extra shit on the side and you know this and that. Oh. Like they're not gonna want to fucking way, develop for uh, that. What is it? What was that zombie game for the, the Zombie U? Zombie U. Uh, they're 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 already playing for a second one. 
Why? It was it was like a good idea. It was idea. a launch game. It was probably one of the games that sold better. Zombie U2 Zombie featuring U2. <laughs> featuring U2. Zombie, Zombie U2. Was, <laughs> they had a good idea. It was just executed. Just, it's so like the cover is maybe, fucking Bono with his glasses. Like Zombified. It was, it was like with Dead Island. Like When Dead Island came out, I was like, okay, this is a really good idea. It's rough around the edges. Let's see what they can do with the next one. They did nothing with the next one. It was like the same thing, same problem. So if they can make the second Zombie U a little bit better, a little bit more, I guess, streamlined. Like, I beat it. I had fun with the game, but it's just... It's hard. It's clunky. If the life of the Wii U lasts, well, I don't. Wii, so, so are we gonna go into separate? Like, what do we think? About I would imagine it? Yeah. that it just like because I, 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 I have a lot of rant about that. I, I, yeah, I have some own. stuff to talk about. Yeah, so. I think that. Okay, so after all this, my like going into it, I think that it just reeks of. I don't want to say desperation because then that's like, <laughs> the whole Steve Blum thing, but it it really seems like they're trying to really nickel and dime stuff at this point because and they're the numbers from their Wii U. The, the fact that their Wii U is coming out, like, right as, or not right as, but, you know, just about, at, considering there's, like, a seven-year time frame for mm -hmm. other consoles, yeah. it's coming out around the same time that the next-gen consoles are coming out. So yeah, that's going to make it even yeah, worse it's for them. Crushed it's going to put them right back to where they were before, exactly. where they're the previous it's, gen, essentially. They're pretty much going back to GameCube right now. But on top of that, <laughs> like, a majority of the shit that we've seen at E3 last year hasn't even been released yet. Look, they had a lot a of good-looking stuff, though, too. Like, yeah. Yeah. Pikmin isn't out. The fucking Wonderful 101 isn't out. Like, what happened all, to that superhero game? All of their... That, I think it was, like, that's Project the something? That's the Wonderful 101. Okay. 100. Yeah, it got yeah, delayed and like shit that. like that. Yeah. Like, all of their, like, I guess, more original IPs, which are straight from Nintendo, and probably a few, like, you know, other developers where they're actually... Lego City Undercover was pretty good, from what I played of it. Like, they're not getting that much support, other than from, you know, themselves. Yeah. yeah. And then those games that they're producing themselves, they, they, they're not even seeing the light of day yet. Like, <laughs> well, there's, there's oh. a lot, of, there's a lot of, like, I know that when they, re they bring the, the remake of the... Uh, Legend of Zelda. That I know that's gonna sell pretty well. I know there's a yeah. few. There's a but few one game selling well will not hold up. No, I, an entire I, I, like. I, 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 that's I, what I, we I, talked I, about I, like I, before. Like I, swapping I, out Mario for Luigi and calling it New Luigi. I, I didn't like you, that. I didn't like, like that. that's not gonna like. That's not, not gonna I, save your I company. I did not like that. I, I saw that. I was like, why? I'll but, give. I'll give my thoughts really quick, and I'm sure it'll sum up just about everyone's. I want to go. You'll, 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 I'll, I'll make it point. quick. Uh, Everybody gets so the, okay. the, the LP business uh, pretty much is summed up. It's, it's a very good thing and pretty much labeled as free marketing for any publishers because you're looking at people that, one, will buy and the game. And that's not something that's like something that we're fucking making up or anything like that. Like companies no, no. tell us that. Like yeah. no, no, we fucking, you know, Ubisoft will say, like, you know, we'll, videos we'll, we'll, or we'll have, we'll have indie a, people will we'll say. A perfect, like a perfect example, the people yeah. from high res Yep. Yeah, their COO they, tweeted out, he's like, you know, if this is true, it's it's a really bad move. And I, yeah. I screen capped my I'm like, yeah, they claimed a couple of my videos, like, that's what they're doing. He's like, you know, there's always going to be companies that will embrace it and that will support like it. High -res, like high-res. Like high-res, They see you know? the potential and the, the value well, of going Well, without like the that. community, where would Minecraft it, be? Oh, exactly. Yeah, yeah. You know, well, that, that like, was another thing. And that, and that said thing, I, uh, I, I think Notch, actually, I don't know if it's real name on Reddit, it's X Notch, but it's an X Notch and... And it was just like, he's like, we had the ability to do this, but we opted out. And well, yeah, he they, tweeted they, that. He, sa he said also, uh, oh, yeah, he tweeted, I'm sorry then. Uh, and then he tweeted also, like, uh, he's like, and if we were to do it, after after we see all the feedback from the community, we we would have stopped. Opted out right yeah. away, yeah. But the thing is, like. And you think, like, someone for you know how much fucking money Notch has? God oh, damn. God. And if, <laughs> if he would have gotten revenue from every Minecraft video. That's, oh, God. That's so much he, money. Fuck no, me. He, he would have been, he would have been, he'd have been set for. Bill a Gates would have had to watch his back. <laughs> Notch would have been fucking coming up on him. Like, they would have been, <laughs> been insane. But, like, that's the one thing that I like about, like, the reality of Notch. That he, he understands, like, you know what? Minecraft was built on YouTube. Like, the, but there's tons of other indie, like, people that are just, like, the sole fucking, you know, like, developer, like, the guy from Thomas uh, Thomas Was Alone or whatever, he, he's, like, the only guy, or I guess he's the, the guy that made it or whatever, but he was saying without YouTube, his sales, with YouTube, his sales, like, he got eight times the amount, pretty much, yeah, from YouTube videos. Go, like, yeah, going into that, I mean, it's it's a mutually beneficial relationship because you have people that pay for the game, game, or you're giving one free copy away to this LPR. They're going to play yeah. the game. It's free publicity. 
And if it's I good, see it's them probably on. making more off of our videos than we make. Oh, easily. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, because they're going to get sales from people that watch the game and are like, oh, yeah. that's cool. They're playing it this way. They suck at it. I'm going to play it. And, do and it, that's you know, dating, like, different. they, like, I mean, when I, when I started with, like, you know, Fable and fucking, like, you know, what was it, you know, Saints 3 and stuff like that, there was, like, a bunch of comments back in the day where it would be like, I would get, I would check this game out now, mm -hmm. like. Yeah, like that's, it's, I mean, it's turning it, especially with games like that where you kind of have your own, you can do your own stuff yeah. more so than linear games. Yeah. But the fact that... Bullshit, even linear games. People are like... Yeah, no, linear games too, but more like, so with it, games it, it that you do. I think with linear games it's funny because they'll be like, man, this guy's having a lot of fun with this game. And then yeah. they pick it up and they're like, why am I not having as much fun as him? Like, <laughs> what but is he doing? Bought, they still bought the game well, because of not, you. It's not, even that, it's not even that. Like uh, when, I did, when, I, when I do like the whole like fighting game and story whatever, they're like people are like, wow, you were really bad at this. And then they're like, oh, I, and they're like, oh, it's because I did it better. Like, people are already like, oh, I'm at the same point. I bought the game out there. You saw me. Mm. I'm at the same point, and I'm doing better than you. So I'm like, oh. Yes, yeah, like, you suck. But I'm like, but you bought the We're game. Pro gamers. Was bad, and you wanted to do it better than me. So I, already I'm bringing more sales regardless if you even do shitty. Yeah, and, and more and more companies over the past, like, year have, uh, more than anything over the past year, have noticed that it's giving, you know, massive boost in sales, and it's easier. Well, you said even Rockstar. It's e yeah, yeah, exactly. It's easier to advertise by giving, by finding these different YouTubers and giving them the games, like, and it's cheaper for them. Oh yeah, like, oh, they don't like, have to advertise. You know, they don't have to spend like, you know, hundred oh grand. For they them, to it's like they don't have to YouTube spend money ad. for it, and all they need to do is be like, okay, we'll just get you like you know an early release, give you a copy free or copy, something like yeah. that. Yeah, it's like okay, sixty bucks, big deal for the amount that you're gonna get. Them. It's not even <laughs> sixty bucks. They're they're like the amount that they spend on making one get like a game copy is like very small because they have a big problem well, yeah that's like that. fucking so it's even less to them <laughs> and it's like okay yeah. here's the m you play it ton of people see it they're like oh i'm gonna pre-order this i'm gonna buy this this is cool and like, yeah, compared right. to you know throwing a, up a youtube ad or something or a tv ad that cost you know yeah. 10 100 grand depending on where it's aired yeah. yep, yep. then that's like if uh, it's it's still effective but not as as cheap the, as, the one thing way. that i'm thinking about is that Plus, you don't know you're 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 you'd be catering to like an in general audience when you do it on TV yep, or whatever. Exactly. Like, you don't know who's gonna see it. Like you go to a gamer, you know his audience is all exactly. gamers. They're, so. they're there to buy this games. Is the best, yeah. This is the best way. But the one thing I was I, I've been like, oh, well, go go finish your point because I I'll, I'll start touching on base on when I. See well, it. I'm I'm pretty much wrapped up because I just wanted to say that it's such a beneficial relationship between companies, well, and it's say, glad that more people are seeing it. But. Um, I, Nintendo's shooting themselves in the foot, and they're only going to go down from here. But before before getting to like each one of us individually, even though you already did yours, but like uh, I just want to quick like uh, do the flip side because that's what I was saying like on Tumblr where people were saying that I was kind of biased against yeah, Nintendo, yeah, yeah. even though I mean I only use my Nintendo like my Wii fucking products for shitty games, but <laughs> I mean at least I use them uh, uh, to some extent. Mm -hmm. But like people were saying, you know, people were saying Nintendo's in the right because. You know they own the copyrights to yeah. it. Like I mean, it's it's their products. Yeah. Like why can't they do? <laughs> they do though. Like they, they do, but it's bad PR to do that. So, yep. It's I mean they can do whatever they want. If they want to do this, that's fine. But it's it's. A it's very, not going to be popular. <laughs> it's not going to be popular, and in yeah. the end, that's not going to help them out at all. Yeah. In fact, so. the thing was, we went the fucking E3 last year. Nintendo were, invited us to their press. What we conference. should do this year is take the footage that we had from last year yeah. and say that's what and we got this it. year. It's and like they, it. they did have a presence. Presence. Look at this. They we got it. <laughs> Look at this massive booth that oh, they had. This year. Or just year. show people how fucking into like the YouTube scene that they were because yeah, they, they were, were fucking. Really cool. They were saying that they love the game night stuff. They love that you know because we do, we were doing Mario Party. We were doing yeah. like yeah, a they lot were of Nintendo. Yeah, they the office and stuff. Like they were really behind YouTube and the YouTube scene. That's why we got we got invited. Us normal fuck. Like people, you the VIP thing. Thing. Yeah, we got invited to the VIP section of fucking the Nintendo booth. Reggie like was that. standing like, right behind me at one point. Yeah. Really? Yep. I yeah, could we smell right. now, his cologne. He, in this day and age, he'd fucking spit on you. A like, <laughs> year like, later, he's like, "Give me your wallet. I'm taking the money out. This is my ad revenue. Yeah. <laughs> you got a fucking job. Like I already have something that prints money anyway, but you need to give me yours." Like what? Yeah, what's this funny? Like <laughs> Fuck that noise. You know what? What really bothers me is, and just uh, it's for everybody, is like. You know, maybe like the creature, the creature hub does have a lot of things involved in Nintendo. Not that many, but it does have a party lot of games. Most a lot party of party games. More than yeah. most. Yeah. What, 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 we what do. really a lot of our me, game night stuff is Wii stuff. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But what really bothers me is like, all right, maybe I won't be affected on my channel as much because yeah, I do have certain things. I'm a really big fan of Nintendo itself, but uh, there's channels out there on YouTube that are humongous. 
that are just solely, that just basically solely does. based yeah. on Nintendo stuff. And then I put myself in their position, like, and, and I, those channels and have I, been around since, like, yeah, you know, we started, like, yeah, 2008. Yeah, and they're, and they're so yeah. they're so dedicated, like the fan base that they created, not only for themselves but for the Nintendo, for the whole company. It's like a big fucking slap to the face, and like, like channels like, uh, and I'm, I'm gonna name drop a few, like Nintendo Capri, whoa, Sun, whoa, uh, Capri. Capri. No. Roy. Capri, Capri. Sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry if I fuck. Have it you up. ever drank like the Capri Sun? Yeah, Capri Sun. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, Chugga, Chugga, Chugga Conroy. Fucking uh, and the whole crew over there, the Runaway guys. Uh, the run, the Runaway guys. Are there? Yes. Run around, guys. Run Stop around. laughing at him. Why are you laughing at him? He had it right. <laughs> yeah. I always say run around, guys. I, yeah, yeah, that's all I've ever heard of. Yeah, it, so it's Runaway well, guys. Run, yeah, they're, they're, it's Chugga, Nintendo Capri Sun, and Proton John. Yeah, they had, they're, it's basically like all Nintendo. Yeah, I would always call him Chugga John. I can never. Chugga John Roy. Like, like I'm. I, I don't watch it stuff like intensively, but I understand what the channel's based off. Yeah. And I, I mean, I'm a fan of a few of their series. And I'm like, all right, this sucks. Like, what if I was in their position? You're legitimately taking somebody that's not only, by the way, entertaining thousands with your product itself and maybe getting you more avenue, but you're shutting down essentially. Yeah. Like, they can't keep doing it if yeah, they, they can't, can't make money off. And it's of not it. because they're not that's fans, they but rely on. they're yeah. still fans. Well, that, that brings, the, like, that's the other point that people, like, you know, against the grain we're saying like you know now we're going to see who the true LPers are because you can still post the videos you just won't make money off yeah of but it. before it's I mean like, these people started off as a, it started as well, all of us started as yeah, a, it's hobby. a hobby yeah. we, we started in our spare time doing it doing our regular but jobs but now people going are school. expecting people like Nintendo people to revert it back to yeah. a hobby because welcome of to this. 2008 then, man. like you but I mean, brought yeah. up the thing where <laughs> I'd keep doing it if I was 15 and I didn't have anything else to do even exactly, then the yeah. fact that you get content <laughs> ID strikes are not exactly a good thing it's not like it's uh, you want to keep uploading just so you yeah, yeah I don't, I don't, I don't think that's yeah. not exactly standing. the best thing to people have. don't understand that they think just content ID matches would be just something that sits there where all the revenue goes to Nintendo but those content IDs those could turn cannot, into strikes yeah. which if you have a, several of them they all hit strikes at once your You're channel is done your channel will disappear. Suspended, they will yeah. delete it like right away. Mm -hmm. So it's not good to have a shit ton of content IDs. Like if, if fucking Chuck Conroy was take, if he continued and he made it just a hobby and he was still uploading a bunch of Nintendo shit, if all of his videos suddenly go from content IDs to strikes, there is no more Chuck Conroy. Yeah. He's gone because everybody wanted He's him to continue had, as a hobby. He's already He's had done. to deal with that before. There was a time, like, I think in 2008, where someone was trying, like, a group of people were trying to prove how flawed their copyright system was. Mm -hmm. And they, like, all these Nintendo LPs were mostly being targeted. Like, DSP was part of it, and it was just, like, Chugga, Nintendo Capri Sun. They, like, claimed Chugga's voice. And what? So, and, like, and, and, yeah, <laughs> YouTube put it through. Like, his channel got shut down. Because of his voice? They, they, they claimed, they showed what, how... Did he sound like Mario or something? I just fucking know. It was, like, this group <laughs> of people who just claimed, like, the strike we got with Deus Ex, I was just, like, a fake Fake, bullshit, yeah, so, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they claimed, as they're like, oh, we're going to show how flawed their, their copyright system is. So they claimed, like, all this random bullshit. His channel got shut down. Eventually, they started to look into, like, you know, how flawed the system is. So it's a little bit better now, but, yeah. like, we still... So they were the, just showing how easy yeah. it was to take down a yeah. channel, they just much. They just filed the strike. They're like, yeah, we own his voice. And they, they're like, okay, you own yeah. his voice. Strike, okay. shut down. YouTube's <laughs> system is already fucked up as is. Oh, so, I mean, <laughs> when you have... When you're constantly uploading as a hobby, and you have, like, 10 to 15 episodes as a hobby being uploaded, but each one of them is having a content ID fucking match yeah. and they all turn strikes then yeah you're fucked like yeah that, that would take quite a bit to even even to if fix. somebody wanted to do it as a hobby and continue their nintendo you lps you still you'd still be at risk to get shut down so, completely so, uh, now, i want to know i want to know what you guys uh, individually if you already kind of said it then you know, can i, I give my thoughts yeah, go for it, go for through it. the voice of james here we uh, go no <laughs> no Away. <laughs> Don't take our LPs away. <laughs> we need them. That's pretty much so all badly. I have to say. All right. Well, all right. Who, who wants to take a stab individually to what they want to say? Like I, just, I was just trying to hit the, uh, the See, you know, the devil's, devil's advocate much. type fucking <laughs> yeah, yeah, points. Well, you can still, you can still, I'm going to do the same way with my points, but... Because those are the two things that I've seen the most, where it's like, yes. you're biased against yes, Nintendo. Yes, they sure do have and the then, rights you know, to do this, but at the same yeah. time, we just think it's a very stupid move. That's yeah. just the, you're just biased against Nintendo, they have the rights to do it, and like, well, let's see who the true LPers are, because now they're not in it for the money or something <laughs> like that. Like, that's just silly. That's a, that's really like a dumb call for like even people to say that. Like, you know what, these people started as a hobby, but you know, now, now the they're way. making a living out of it, and now you're going to like call them out because... They were making a living out of this. Like, are you 
that's like so fucking dumb. Like it just like I, I was talking like, who are you really hurting? Like, yeah. if, unless someone can prove that if LPs someone is in the real world in the trenches working a real job, you should not be we're gonna able. Get, check, check. To I'm gonna call. I'm gonna come with that right away too. <laughs> I mean, that's yeah. You, that's, you, you, you get ready for that like, one. Un unless they can prove, you know, maybe LPs do damage sales, but like, if it's a good game, people are gonna buy it anyway. Mm -hmm. If it's a bad game, you know, what about reviews? Like, if if there's a movie review and 90% of it is yeah. shit. You know what? I don't though? even need to see any footage you know of the movie. Just though? recently, with Deadly Premonition or whatever, remember when it first came out, mm -hmm. got shat on review wise. One fucking guy gave it a 10 out of 10. Oh my god. There you go. Like, everyone's fucking buzzed about why Why'd this guy give it a 10 out of 10. Yeah. Like, you know, it was, that, it was that fucking. To buy it. it was that yeah, Jim I Sterling that. guy or whatever, and he bashes a shit ton of oh, games. Oh, yeah, he does, yeah. And he gave Deadly Premonition a 10 out of 10. He's, He's really like, all over the place. Like, I used to watch his reviews often. He might have mood shifts or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> like, Checkbook like, I mean, I'm not in the mood for this. Game. Sometimes it feels like he's only into indie games, and then other times it feels like he's, like, really against the big, like, big budget yeah. AAA yeah. titles or whatever. But, like, then it's he's just really. Really yeah, I don't, I don't really, I don't really like yeah, many. something called the checkbook shifts right there. <laughs> the many <itself> like <laughs> reviewers and editors and stuff like that. They, yeah. yeah, they might seem like they're being bought <laughs> off, or they always seem so. I like, don't know, maybe it's just like he, he has really. That's like another a taste. thing about but that's the same, that's the whole the same thing, thing with, with a lot of people. They seem the on whole, and off. The like, whole thing with YouTube, sometimes yeah, some people will say, oh, this is nice, but a lot of honesty comes with people like like someone with shame. It's like if he doesn't like the fucking game, they'll tell you it sucks. And he Most of the time, I'm pretty lenient. Like yeah, even with the lenient. Star Trek. And Seamus, yeah, Seamus has like a really open mind with games that we. If think I have suck. some fun with it, then I will give it an okay score. Like even if it's just pooped on. Like yeah. Star Trek, mm -hmm. it was, I had some fun with it. I mean, it was it was kind of cool. Poopy. It was cool, but it was just it wore off after a while. Those yeah. Wii games are complete shit. I'm not gonna <laughs> say they're good. So. Well, I'm saying, but anyways, well, are we gonna go to individual points? Or you want to start? Well, I was just gonna good. say oh, quick um, that I finally got my laptop good to go for recording Wii stuff. <laughs> just the other day, and then they announced. <laughs> this, so. Hey, I got I got my artist to make me thumbnails for it for oh, God, I don't for Mario, Mario Game Galaxy over. I don't One and Two. Because I'm not gonna. Be it ready. seems like they've been trying to get like at least for right now from the Wii U. They've been trying to get movie. new Wii U stuff. Yeah, that's like, what I noticed. Mm -hmm. Only a couple parts of my new Super Mario Bros. U or whatever the hell it's called have been claimed so far. Yeah. But uh, yeah, you, you, why don't we? Why don't we start? Whoever wants to well, start. Well, anyone who has anything to add, because we have kind of. Like you, you said you wanted to go on a well, big ass uh, rant. All right, all right. Oh, so, going on so, right so, so, I, right, I'm marking a lot time. of people. I, I noticed that a lot of YouTubers on uh, on, on Twitter went off, and they're like, "Yeah, I, this is a this is a complete disgrace. This is a slap to the face to us YouTubers, and this is just you know, I'm not gonna I'm gonna completely boycott Nintendo and everything, and I'm not gonna play anything involved. And then I'm like. All right, well, that's your decision. I'm going to keep playing certain things. That I came I up with EA, too, though. When they right. had, like, the DRM, like, uh, with Dead Space and stuff, people were like, you know, I'm not going to get into EA stuff. I'm going to boycott them. It was, yeah. it was pretty much the same situation. Well, How do you know they didn't mean, like, boycott as in boycott, like, I'm not going to do any videos? Yeah, no, I understand, it. but... I, I, they might I, still buy Nintendo No, no, yeah, no, it, that's what I said. Like, no, but I, with, uh, where certain people are like, yeah, I'm not even going to buy the games anymore and everything. And I'm like, well, you know what? If it jeopardizes my channel, yeah, I'm not going to upload it, but I'm still going to buy games. And they're like, oh, but you're still supporting them. That, that means, you know, you still don't care about them. And I'm like, that doesn't mean, like, it's not, it, like. Still bought Rockstar games even when they yeah. wouldn't allow me to no, put it no, up. No, like, but, I mean, but the thing is, like, what it came down to is, like, like you know what? I, I am not a fan of the shitty behavior that Nintendo has. I am not a fan of the so shitty behavior that Nintendo has right now. Yeah. But... That doesn't mean that I'm not a fan of the specific IPs or uh, titles that come out. No. I just because because Nintendo, uh, like, and, and this is an exaggeration. Just because uh, Metal Gear got a, a remake of whatever on the GameCube, am I? Does that mean that I'm not gonna play any more Metal Gear? Even though I started playing Metal Gear on the PlayStation, does that mean that I become not a fan of everything that Nintendo slightly touches? Am I not a fan of Pokemon? Am I not a fan of Sonic? Because Nintendo has to involve. No, I'm gonna still. If they make good titles and good games, I'm gonna still play them. And but a lot of people just have this mentality where they're like, "No, you mean you're allowing this to happen?" I'm like it's not the case, dude. Like, if if it jeopardizes my job, I'm not gonna put it. I'm not gonna do it. But I'm still a fan of the Metal Gear series. I'm still a fan of Mario. I'm just not a fan of how Nintendo is is being right now. And yeah, I just, I hate the idea that people like try to look down on me. Oh, you you bad because like. It's not that I'm bad, it's just like, I had so many warm childhood memories with this, it's a part of who I am, and I'm just not going to stop it just because it jeopardizes my job. Yeah, I'll stop it in my job, 
and avoid getting fucked over by that. I think they've been using too much, uh, too much cr- like crutch work as of late. Anyway, though, yeah. like you mentioned Mario and Sonic and stuff like that. But that's like that's, that's all that's that they, that's kind of like all that's the been standard, to their name. Yeah. Like Smash, I remember back when it keeps getting rehashed. Yeah, constantly. I remember back when Nintendo was getting fucking. They were getting like exclusive rights. They had fucking Resident Evil Four on the GameCube yeah. before anybody, and yeah. that was like. Bestseller for them. Like, what happened to they when they were getting all this anymore. shit? When they just I had a control. No, they don't have it anymore. No, it's on like every console. No, no one the fucking it. when the Nintendo 64 came out. Like, they had like all these different other games, like Wave Racer and like and Wave Glover Racer, yeah. Glover, Glover, With like the hand. Yeah, had a lot of like <laughs> but for the time. It's like it was like it seemed like there was shit. a lot more experimenting. Yeah, like in that age. I think I think they're being really like trapped in. Like, they a stick to what's safe. And like, yeah, uh, that's what it's that's not turning safe spending all their anymore. money on hardware development. Yeah. Yeah, probably. <laughs> they, but this is this is I'm sorry, go ahead. Go no, ahead. no, go, go ahead. It was this is the one thing that bothers me most and a lot of people like with with the whole what Jenny says, it's like here's where you'll see what true less players are. Or here you'll see you like I s I think I, I was going through joystick and you were talking to me about how saying like, Oh fuck it, YouTubers don't deserve this, whatever. That's not a real job. Like that's what the comments were. Yeah, on and, and yeah. like, like well, I, I, to all the fans, regardless if you like us or not like us or you stop, whatever, whatever the case is. To the fans that don't like us. Yeah, to the fans that don't like us, the, the non-fans, I guess. The nega fans. <laughs> the nega fans. <laughs> I, I. <laughs> That's not what he's saying. <laughs> yeah. and, like nega Scott N E. Stop saying that word. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Isn't that from, uh, from Scott Pilgrim vs. the World? Well, it was also in a cartoon that was on Nick. Uh, Fairly Odd Parents, I think. Oh yeah, they had like Nega Man or whatever. It was like the anti. But but it sounds My really. God. It, yeah. sounds, it, sounds, it sounds really close, and they're just capitalizing on that. We're so. getting pretty damn close here to racist. <laughs> but it's not my fault. The word is similar. <laughs> here's here's what here's what really bothers me. To anybody that doesn't know, I, I guess this is something that maybe to anybody that's outside the field will never understand. Being a YouTuber yourself, a less player, or somebody that makes shorts or skits, or whatever. A lot of people think that this is not a real job, and the funny thing is, like, yeah, we can set the tone of our, our channel. We can set the like, if we want to upload just one video a week, we can do that. But essentially, that wouldn't really like help well, some us. People it, it some people do do that. I yeah, mean. and like some people can pull that off. Like, like uh, let's say like Freddie Freddie Wong, mm-hmm. like he can do that because like he works really hard on one specific one, and that video itself yeah. gives him enough revenue to either continue his company, or whatever. But like to anybody, to anybody out there that thinks that this YouTuber thing is a it's a walk in the park, it's it's it can like be difficult. it is the most annoying thing to 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 hear from anybody. It's like oh your job is not a real job. You know we go on the, on the fact that one we need to be entertaining on it like per you hour. You only see not, the fun aspects and huh? the easy aspects playing games. That's what everyone else sees. Yeah, yeah everybody games. just sees like oh they're just sitting there like all right come, this. There's times when we have problems with our hardware where we like we lose hours of footage that we needed. And we deal with YouTube. We deal and with the YouTube cinema. changes. Yeah, and most of the time the response is just like, you know, where is this or where is that at? But yeah, they no. don't know that like you spent three hours recording it and you know, capture card fucked up and you lost it. Like there's nothing and you, you have can to do. do it again or not do it. In and some cases you can't you can't go back to that checkpoint and redo it. You have to replay the entire fucking yeah, game. And I, 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 no, no, no that's that. what I had to do with Alice. <laughs> Alice Man that Returns. I had to play the whole thing, and it was just platforms after platforms. I did that, was, I I, did that with Resident Evil 2. When I recorded point. Portal 2 when it came out, I recorded four hours straight <sighs> with no... Uh, the mic wasn't going. Oh god! And I, I like look at my footage and I was like, "You get no!" My, your, your heart doesn't your heart like stop for yes, a second? Oh, it stops so and it just sinks, and I'm like, "Oh my god!" Post commentary. That's you get know, fucking right. aggravated. Yeah. I just went through. I blew through it again. I just went and like, I did it like an hour. All right, and I do all the puzzles. It this is something fun. me and Seamus we were talking about in the car drive when we came here, and I, I, I guess we can touch base on that real quick if that's cool with you. Um, somebody was saying that. Well, go ahead. What was it? What was that comment Which specifically? One? The like, like, uh, yeah, you can get this and this and this, but I'd rather do this because it feels like you validate. Or what was what was the word that he used? That you? What's happening here? Me and, <laughs> me and I can't remember. We're t- we're talking about how somebody's saying that that if yeah, uh, ha- being a YouTuber doing let's play, it might be more fun and this and that. But he would actually w- w- rather work in like a fast food place because he feels more accomplishment or something like that? Oh, some people would seem to have the mentality that, like, you know, okay, you do YouTube is a living, and it's, you know, 
not very prestigious. It's just kind of like you're kind of a leech on society. Or oh like, yeah, how can you be like, fulfilled with just that? How can you be yeah. fulfilled? Like, what are you? What are you gonna do when this is done? You you learned nothing and why I'm in college. Yeah, pretty <laughs> much like that. And then it's just kind of like, well, why why would I be respected more if I still had my minimum wage job at Target? Because instead of doing YouTube stuff and, and being, you know, a leech or whatever, I would be working at Target. And instead it would be like, well, 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 you need to go to college. You need to get a degree. You need to get a better job. You're just, you can't work this minimum wage job. For, it's, you need it's to have $80,000 of student loans. It's always going to be, gonna be <laughs> yeah, student loans completely fucked me over, Seems by the way. way more fulfilling. I mean, we're, 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 well, like, we're not leaving we're a mark like... In the world, no, or no, like no, you know, something all. like that. But not like in disease, terms of internet but... and stuff like that, we got a little, we got a little like you know, a little, little blemish there. Yeah, a little, talk, we have a like mark I, there. I, I personally, and I know that um, a lot of you guys might have gone this. Like there has been people through our entertaining videos or what we do. They say like I came, I came from a day at school or work that just complete shit. And I, I, I have people saying that they were depressed. They, they were even. Oh yeah, that's pretty fulfilling when yeah, you hear I that. Love here. No, we, we've yeah. seen people at events that are like, I was in the hospital for like two weeks. Uh, one kid had like leukemia or something. Yeah. Was like, I, you guys got me through my. Uh, through my radiation treatment. There's many people who yeah, are against yeah. it. How are you going to do that working at Target? How are you going to, I mean, yeah. I, I, I sent a kid who was in the hospital a there. signed shirt of yeah. everyone that, uh, at, at PAX, I had you all sign a shirt um, uh, and I sent it to a kid in the hospital because my mom had you know, to As many someone. people as are who say like, oh, you guys aren't doing anything, you know, you're wasting your lives with this, it's going to end at some point. I mean, we get letters from people like, you know, I was this close to committing suicide and I watched your videos and it helped me get through it. It's like, this isn't an every case thing, but no, we no, do get letters like dude, that. And it's like, dude, I never got, believe me, I wish I got a no, text No, the way that you was, scanned my items at Target. Dude. <laughs> oh my that's, God. That'll be, God. That'll be no. 595, man. I just like no. pull you to the side man, and be I, like, I, man. I, I, see I was going to commit suicide, hey, but. I was ordering <laughs> that. Mac Burger and I seen you flip that patty and it just changed my, changed my life. It changed my day. I'm, like, I'm happy. Dude just yeah. fucking walks back count. into the kitchen. It's like the way you flip those patties. Like hey, you know what though? Like I can I can count how many. Stay here forever. <laughs> I can count how many got times I got a kid. compliment working in a fast food or working in a factory. Yeah, I got like maybe one. It was for the boss telling me to work harder. <laughs> like like like. <laughs> Good job. Now work harder. Yeah, like like seriously like. To anybody that thinks this is not a real job, how is this any different from from television? How is this I've always said like it's not the hardest thing in the world because we all like to do it. So yeah, like well, it, it doesn't seem like work to us. When we when you love it's that one saying. But everyone love, everyone wants to find that one thing that they like doing and doing it for a living. I'm gonna take a word. I mean, I'm gonna take a little quick sentence from the new uh, the new Coors commercial. Okay. Um, We're not sponsored by them. Not could yet. Be. <laughs> One day. Uh, it says if you work a job you or if you have a job you love, you don't, never work a day in your life. Yeah, that's, that's not from course. That's old that's as an old fuck. saying. No, that's from course. They reinvented it. I saw it on yeah, course. They, they reinvented it. Oh my god, you're it's the best. Level just. I saw it on the commercials. So that's where I. Yeah, knew I was it gonna from, say. Man. By the way, when you cut me, that's what I was gonna say. But thanks, anyways. But regardless of anything, like. We put as much effort. I, if anything, I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a quick example of the person that that just m like mind fucks me of how much work he does. Obviously, you guys know him, Mortal HD. <laughs> that no, I don't care about whatever Kucha said. He's yeah, him and Dex were working he, like, yeah, really he, hard on Sanity. All right, so he has his YouTube channel to take care of. He has now to do things for Sanity not included, and he has other things like he personal, real personal stuff. This dude works and the, all the the. I think it's been like one or two months that he's like lived with me. Those two months, I rarely get to see him. Like we get to hang out every now and then, but this dude works every fucking single day. Every day, he either works. He, he I, I, I saw him yesterday. He was like, "Oh, I got like ten different games." So he's like, "Oh, I went to games, so I got ten different games." So I'm like, "What are you doing?" He's like, "Oh, I'm gonna play like an hour or two of each one, so I can get." Yeah, just sport. to get just to get so sanity to get, stuff. Like, like, and and that's one like that's one of the uh, of of the YouTubers out there. This dude works every fucking single day. Not the, there's not he doesn't get Friday and Saturday off. Yeah, the, if we work hard enough and we like let's say we want to prepare for like a vacation, that means that we that that two weeks ahead of time we get to fucking work hardcore and maybe we'll get a week or two. But reality is it's is that if you are a YouTuber and you're inconsistent. Chances are you're gonna start fading off the 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 YouTube like I guess spotlight because like people get tired of, like oh I'm tired of waiting so I'm gonna go to another YouTuber too so you constantly have to worry about so many fucking things in comparison to when I used to work at this fucking yarn factory I need to, I remember that I need to be there at six in the morning punch in my car 
do the same stupid labor back and forth and then come back. And it was just so obvious and predicted. Hold on, wait. You worked in a yarn factory? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Was that like the movie Mouse Hunt, where they had the, <laughs> the yarn factory that they turned into it the... It wasn't that fun. Oh, it was the string factory that they turned into you a cheese factory. Me? No. They, they, they had the string cheese balls, and, and the mouse <laughs> came in. You're sitting here tearing up with that speech. In. Yeah, oh. thanks. Fucking passionate. Thanks. I'm sorry, I just got I just got back from thanks. taking a shit. So. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's cool. Great. I'm but sorry. It's like, it's like I, I'm telling you, like, but I for, for, for like, or like a, a job at McDonald's, when I used to work at McDonald's, what they tell you is like, you're going to be a cook. Here's what you need to do. You got the frozen patties, you put them, you press the button, it comes down, done, and you hand it over to the people making the sandwich. That was such an obvious, simple thing to do, and, and I didn't, it was easy, it was easy. When, when it comes to YouTube, I need to learn how YouTube is fucking us up, and what do I need to do? <laughs> do I need to make sure that I, like, oh, I can't make long videos because if one of my subscribers, or, or my subscribers only watch halfway, or not even 20% of it, that doesn't count as a view. So now my right. work that I put is completely not even noticed. So I need to find a way to make sure, like, I, do I need to make them shorter to actually get the attention span? There goes a lot of fucking things. There's a lot of thinking, a lot of work and effort. And a lot of you guys out there don't even notice that. Don't even know that it's gone. And guess what? We don't need to. Right now we're ranting about it, or it's specifically me I'm ranting about it, because... Yeah. Because, <laughs> of, because of the Nintendo yeah. shit, because of the Nintendo shit going yeah. on, but it's because people are saying, "Shut the fuck up with your finger trolling, you Cinderella bitch." I don't even give a fuck <laughs> about your head. Cinderella bitch. All right, Kutra. Okay. <laughs> but reality is behind it, it's like this job is really unstable in a way. You never know what's gonna happen. It can change, and it's and, so much and where a normal job or what you guys think is a fulfilling job, it's just. Simple. It's just like do this, do this, do this, and that's it. It becomes repetitive, monotone, and just gets boring. And then that's why people start slacking and they get fired. Whereas in us, we just fucking do so much shit. And to to say, oh, let's play or being a YouTuber doesn't count. Yeah, some YouTubers are lazy as fuck, but don't throw us into the mix with them when we're busting our ass for all of you. So at guys. the end of the day, this is this a is job. a fucking this is a fucking job. Back to Nintendo. Back to Nintendo. <laughs> Oh yeah, I, oh, yeah. Uh, were we talking about them at one point? It was 5% <laughs> Nintendo and about 95% this is the real job. We're on the <laughs> second of eight topics we have today, and we're well, over the first two into the show. Well, well was, this one... Is, is there anything else Nintendo-wise? Nintendo-wise, like I said, you know, whoever, like... Bottom line, we put in a lot of work, mm -hmm. so it shouldn't be taken lightly, and right? To, to be honest, Nintendo, it? Nintendo's making a really... For me, as a fan, I think they're making one of the biggest mistakes they're doing now. Not only because yeah. I'm just a little I personally player. like I like getting feedback back from like devs and stuff like that. Like I would much rather make a video, regardless of game quality, I would much rather make a video on like a game where a developer will actually like, you know, comment on it or something like that and be like, you know, they they realize that it's it's good stuff or, you know, whatever, like the fucking telltale guys when it came to the walking dead i could see my thumbnail over there for the walking dead so that reminded <laughs> me of that where it's like you know they used they use some of our clips for when fucking yeah i'm not gonna spoil it but like i mean like they they like there's companies that you were talking about ubisoft is all into it now yeah. like like it, it's yeah, better threw dan out there yeah it's yeah. better it's a better feeling overall when you get that kind of feedback and it, and, 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 talking, and it makes you feel like shit when you're doing like when you're like so fucking happy about this nintendo stuff and you're like you know you go to show it off and nintendo's just like shitting on you like yeah <laughs> fuck you the fact that like, so far this year we've had we've we've developed relationships with deep silver um, the guys at Payday, high res, and then you guys like different, different other. We've done some stuff with EA a little bit. And yeah, a little bit. A little bit of EA. But yeah, it's cool. And I don't then, know like, if I talked. I don't know if I talked about it, but like they were talking about um, when we were there playing the game, we were like really kind of the first fans to sit down and play the game because usually they're really? just, it's either testers or like press coming through. So it was like the first time they got to see fans of the game play the game and see how they play it, and it was before like, before yeah wow. yeah it was like it was like really cool for, for them part, to sit down and watch us. For them exactly that's that's, that's, that's like, feedback. yeah yeah it's like how can how can you know like. Like, if Nintendo's not going to watch how somebody... They're just assuming, you know, everyone plays Mario the same way, like... <laughs> not us. Were, like, when yeah, we, when we got yeah that, no. That was... Man, when we got to that station, it was just like, who can screw each other over we're the most? We were just griefing each other and shit. <laughs> and they, the chick was just like, 
That's not how you're supposed to play. Oh, that's how we're gonna play. Yeah. <laughs> She's like, no, you're supposed to put the blocks down to help each other. James, no. James <laughs> puts it all the way around, knocks someone in the lava. Listen here, bitch. We know how to fucking play. <laughs> Step off. No wonder they never contacted us. <laughs> you record this footage. You take this shit back to Reggie, and you show how we play. And, like, and you put a mini game in here that lets us do yeah. this. It rewards us. Encourage this shit. <laughs> it rewards you for <laughs> more grief will over. I like it. But that's how like I mean that's how better games get like crafted I'm just when the, when they have the uh you know I'm ability to see it's so much better getting yeah. dev the face it was put it's stun. exciting. <laughs> I yeah, was Jameis. So anytime like there's obviously a topic of conversation that there's two differing opinions and you know, there's gonna be one against me. I, I always try to understand the other side. Yeah, yeah that's why I brought up. I, I try not points. to be biased. I try not to just be like, I, no, I, I'm right. You know, I try to put myself in other people's shoes. So like, I, I understand that Nintendo makes a game. You know, that they have the copyrights. They have the right to claim it. Mm -hmm. um, I'm kind of okay with that, but like, it's not going to be a popular decision. Like. This has been going on for five or six years. Like, the LP community, like, it started out really small. Within the past I feel like, in a way, they should, if they want to do this, they should just be like Rockstar and just pull the videos down. Like, yeah. why leave the videos up? Because they want the free publicity they and they want, the want that money. shit. Yeah. But then they also want the money, They'll too. It's like, it. that's mm -hmm. not good. Like, Rockstar at least would shut it down. Like, that's Rockstar's like, not that's getting like it. Yeah. Like, that's like that owner's taking the, the Oh, tip yeah, the tips. From the, from the waitresses. <laughs> Whoa, full <laughs> circle. Yeah, yeah. yeah we came back. Having your cake we planned this all along. Yeah. Having your cake and eating it too. That's what That's Nintendo's bullshit. doing, pretty yeah. much. So yeah. we've, we've had channels that have done LPs like Chuck Conroy. He was probably one of the oldest ones that did kind of full stuff. That yeah. it's been going on for like five or six years. The so. dude dedicates it. No, yeah. When the oh, I don't know if he has a new layout, but the dude dedic when he's playing the game. He yeah, he has like you know, one game. He has like oh you know here are my past you know projects and it took this long to do it. You can find it here. Here's a link. But like it, it's been going on for so long, five six years. In mm -hmm. the past year or two, it's, it's gotten popular. Like. Why now? Why why now would they want to step in and kind of put it to a halt? <laughs> like <Yeah. laughs> YouTube offered it. That's you know. that's one thing I don't understand. Like you don't know if YouTube offered them the partnership or if they took a part. Like what if no, they uh, applied for it? Isn't it? Uh, Notch was saying said, that yeah. they went around all the publishers yeah. and offered them. Do you want to claim revenue? For oh, the YouTube game? did. Yeah. Yep. yeah. And Notch was offered that, and he said he was tempted to take it, but he didn't. said no. I would have been so upset at him if he did. I'm like, yeah, well, yeah, they would have gone like, right back like, on like, him. With Nintendo, like I am, I, with Nintendo, I'm upset, wow. but you know what? Nintendo was like already like kind of established a little bit already before the whole YouTube explosion thing. Like, yeah. Nintendo was a big name already from the gate. So I'm mm -hmm. like, all right, but someone like Notch, if you were to do that, I'm like, are you fucking serious? Your game explored due to YouTube. Are you fucking serious? But yeah, I, I think I think a but big he part didn't of that do was. It. And that's why I'm proud of him. He didn't I'm do it. I'm proud of him too. He thought of it. We love you. I'm I'm Marcus, little, I'm having a hard time right now because he thought of it. Huh? Oh well. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm, I'm sure if you have like not. millions of dollars placed right in front of you, you're like, Ooh. oh yeah. He's probably <laughs> like, mm, man. dude. I don't, but yeah. I don't know. Twisting his little <laughs> so pencil thin mustache. They, they try. They're jumping in now with it. I, I, it's kind of worrying because it's like, okay, we don't really do Nintendo stuff a lot. We do it for the hub, for the party stuff. But like, if other developers start doing this, then it's like, okay, well, we can't do this, this, and this. You know, we wouldn't get paid for that. So then we're gonna know, have Minecraft only channels here. Help yeah, me. so it's <laughs> like it's like who who else is gonna jump into it? Like, is this be, gonna be a normal thing, or is it just gonna be Nintendo and they're gonna get pooped on and then go back on it? So it's like I feel like it, wasn't there another company other than? But Microsoft? I think most companies are gonna see they that with this that Nintendo doing especially it, especially with Nintendo doing the it. cut that like okay initially yeah Nintendo's probably gonna get a good bit back, but once people start realizing it and they're you know they start dying down the Nintendo content, how much is Nintendo gonna make off of that? Yeah, they're not gonna make anything. They're yeah, not gonna make much. So it's just like they made the community mad, and now the revenue yeah. stream is just gonna sink. And they down. partnered up with YouTube for like no reason because they're not gonna get much out of it. Yeah. Like, Unless their goal was to get people to stop doing it. True. Yeah. True. Well, that, that can always be. They want to take, take the, the videos video. down. Yeah, they, they would just uh, strike them. But they're no, trying. They, to say but they're smart though. They're like, oh, we're not gonna take your videos, but we're gonna take the money you get. <laughs> Suck a dick. Like I was like, that's what I said. Like have having the kids. Yeah, it seems. What you were saying, James? The sad thing is, is like you know, we don't do much Nintendo stuff. Mm -hmm. Like I do Mario hacks, which Nintendo probably isn't really going to claim anyway. Because I, I don't know why they would claim you know oh, a God. twenty year old. You never yeah. know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I said like I made a video, of, a Mario hack video, talking about. It. I was like you know if if hypothetically they claim every Mario hack video I do, I'm still going to do them because I like doing them. Mm -hmm. Like even if I'm not getting money from it, I'm still going to do it. Like, yeah. I'm not just going to stop cold turkey, but. There are a lot of channels that are just solely dedicated to it, like Chuck Conroy, Nintendo Pre-Sun, mm -hmm. all of them. Like, 
I, I want to say that, like, we kind of help out the economy a little bit. Like, we're not like, oh, man, we're, we're rejuvenating the economy. No, but, like, we're not. We, no. have to, we have to spend money on equipment, the games. You know, if we go to conventions, we need flights. Like, all that stuff isn't cheap, and a lot of the money that we get, we also put back to, you know, go to these conventions. And, and there's and companies based with. around, actually, like, youth tours now. Uh, what yeah, is, there's, there's like, a lot uh, of different what, networks. What, what is it? Uh, no, not even like that. Uh, they, they make equipment specially oh, yeah, for yeah, YouTubers. I'm like sure. I think, uh, what was this product called? El Gato? Or something like that. No it's, plugging. Oh, please. Shut the fuck no up. Is that a capture no card? Plugging. Yeah, but whatever. No plugging, it's, it's, like a, it's a recording device. Please, I'm a black nope. magic guy. Please. I'm a black magic please, guy. Please, I'm a black plug magic guy. Anything. You You're guys, trying to explain please. what this device is and the, the product. Don't oh, bring up the, the hop hog. The hop hog. <laughs> the hoppage. The hoppage. The hoppage. The hoppage. Are we, are we the done? Hop hop are we done? Jerk. All right, give me a second. Roxio game capture what? <laughs> <laughs> Dazzle. <laughs> so this, there was like apparently, Pinnacle. apparently this 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 company made it to like now like bigger companies like Best Buy like are now selling yeah. this this kind of thing. It's like, like we're becoming a known entity. Oh, yeah, yeah. I actually seen the PVR at a Best Buy. Yeah, I seen a oh, lot of. Uh, I seen a, a few Fuck things. Fuck you. I've seen it there Fuck. forever. <laughs> you know what? I haven't needed to go and search for a, a capture card because I'm a black magic guy. Hey. Hey. Although you can't Who is the one that James, started it James, all? I can't black James, magic. James, I'm can't a black song. magic card. Who was the guy that started it all and you had the first black magic out of anyone? Probably you. Who's the stupid guy with the hat? Right I'll here. show you right black here. magic. Whoa! <laughs> That's racist. I'll show I you. I got the magic <laughs> in me. I got the magic, <laughs> baby. Uh, you, hey, anything else we want to keep going? I'm sorry. We keep cutting. Yeah, I keep, I keep losing my flow. And I'm, I'm sorry. Kind of I forgot. Yeah, good job. Sam. But like some of, some of the other people said, like, oh, you know, this is good. You know, if. Maybe if people want to make money on this, they'll Nintendo will give you a license to do it. So not not only that that was literally a suggestion that people wanted. So I don't know if you if you know anything about like music licenses, oh, but they're expensive as hell and they they expire yeah. after a certain amount of time. Mostly and then you gotta take everything down. So Isn't that we, the deal with like uh, Rock Band and shit? That they do they have to pull songs off because they expire mm -hmm. from from the first Rock Band to like the second Rock Metallica Band. Metallica was they, yeah they had to drop a couple songs because yeah. the license expired and they mm -hmm. they couldn't renew it. So that's the same deal with the wrestling games too. They have, they have licenses. so so basically we have to spend. I don't know. Music licenses are expensive. I don't know. Yep. If it'd be, it, they're definitely not gonna give people licenses for like fifty bucks. Well, so it's like with big names, you're never gonna get a yeah. chance. It's like probably gonna cost thousands of dollars to get the license for one game, mm -hmm. which. Most people aren't going to be able to afford. Only, only probably the biggest of the big YouTubers could afford this. Hey James, and you gonna get all of them? I will buy you a Nintendo yeah. license, oh, so that you way go. you can play. It would probably be on a per game basis I, though. Yeah, so. I, just, I was trying to think of a game. Okay. And I couldn't even think so of a you game. give us you give us fifteen grand and you can play Mario on YouTube. Well. You're probably not going to get that money back, so you're oh. putting yourself in a hole. You're stopping new people from starting. Mm -hmm. You have to buy all the equipment and everything anyway, so it's it's just going to slow but everything down. You own down that market. You own that market. <laughs> and, uh, Monopoly. Down in seven months. In seven months, you got to take it and down, and that's it. So hopefully, you made fifteen grand on it. <laughs> wow. But it, I, I just I just don't know like what they're really trying to do. I'm and confused. I'm. Uh, it, you know what? It's just I never. And that's a, it. All a, goes back to the fact that they're pulling a THQ. But you would think if they're not if they're not as like if they're not as into the community, they might not know much about like the YouTube scene. You think? Well, they were weren't they just getting into it last year when they we were still like the only YouTubers that they fucking invited yeah, to the press much. conference. Yeah. We were in a sea of suits. Like, it was was in front of us. There, yeah, there Activision wasn't CEO. There wasn't oh, wow. that many like uh, you know YouTubers, I guess, around. But like no. they they just started seemingly getting into it. But they don't. And have, now they like, go ass backwards. Well, they don't have an understanding of it. Like they don't know. Hopefully, like if you put on paper, if YouTube is like you know all the videos that get posted, you'll get the revenue off of them. Maybe probably, they just saw a dollar sign. You know, of course, they see a dollar yeah. sign. Yeah, on paper, they're, they're it's just not like, really like understanding of what the what the concept is. Yeah, yeah. No, they I don't just, really have a grasp on that. I just wish the best of luck for people who are like Nintendo only channels yeah. that Nintendo either goes back on it or they can find some way to keep things up because you know the whole true LPs thing like I already said that if I'm make, not making money that I'm going to make videos anyway yeah. regardless if I'm making money or not but I have to get a job to sustain myself I'm not going to be able to spend as much time on these videos as I want yeah. I'm going to have to upload less like that's going to be across the board with everyone if no one is making money because we all came from jobs. Like, yeah. You know, yeah. real Target, Yarn Factory, Twizzler Factory, Golf Course, <laughs> the gas station thing. We that all was came. a really cool job, though. And yeah. I had a lot of well, fun. you probably had the best job out of anyone. Yeah, that was my only But job. we all came from that. We all started as a hobby. Like, I was going to, to 
college classes and working and trying to do YouTube. I was getting like two to four hours of sleep. Like, I don't want to go back to that again. Like that. I'm just lucky that it, it kind of worked out in the but end. The thing is, like, you didn't, the, it didn't happen like it was like, a it wasn't over, I, I did it you for had two to, years you without had to getting work, paid. You had to work your ass for that. Yeah, it especially was, you. It was fun. Mr. King of videos over here. Yeah, it, it was fun. Like, even though I spent a lot of sleepless nights doing it, it's what I wanted to do. Even though I wasn't getting paid, I like people who watch my stuff and the feedback that mm -hmm. came from it. But, you know, if, if it turns into something we can't have as a job anymore, then we have to get, you know, the real jobs. And guess what? That and means even less videos. That means less videos. The community is probably going to be slowed down a bit. It just it doesn't and ring then well. Now, and then not, then the fans will be like, oh, man, no, no. Yeah. I wish it was a job. I, I just I don't <laughs> think it, it bodes well, particularly no. for, for anyone, especially right now the Nintendo-only people because I pay attention to that community. Yeah, same and here. Their channels are pretty much completely, like, older and newer Nintendo stuff. Like, I just hope that it works out. Too everyone. much complications I these think days. That yeah. For to all, the, especially all those. I hope this is Coney twenty twelve again. And it just blows off and Nintendo's like we're done. <laughs> Nintendo's yeah, like late we'll April see. Fool's joke. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll see. About here's that. all the money back. Here. I think what Nintendo should. Uh, for a lot of people that are saying, you know, that we're like, oh, th this is stupid. We feel entitled that we should be able to still play their games and stuff like that. It's not. It's not just that. It goes into the fact that. Uh, it's we feel bad that Nintendo is kind of making this, and we know it's kind of a stupid decision. It's kind of a roadblock. Right so now. for something that was growing so fast yeah. and so well, it's kind of like a lot of us were setting up to even do more Nintendo stuff because like yeah, like somebody here that set up their by, like somebody here that got thumbnails done for something already. Like somebody. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was going to do Lego yeah, City Undercover. I don't know if they would claim it. People have been saying it's mostly like the newer first Mario party, stuff. Like first yeah. party. So. Yeah, so, I'm thinking first but party. But seeing as how no one's developing for the Wii U, there won't be a lot of third party stuff. No, it's just going to be all first party. <laughs> yeah, so you know, so, there goes all that. Okay, well, I think the, the wrap-up statement for this is kind of like what I said at the beginning. Please rethink your stance. Nintendo, Nintendo, rethink your stance. This is a mutually beneficial relationship that will, in fact, benefit you guys more than claiming money on YouTube videos <laughs> in the long run. So, And believe me, there won't be a lot of videos There's for you to claim. Like, well, no, it's Soon. just flickering. It's what in the world? There won't be a lot of videos for you guys to claim in the future if you keep it up. Yep, and then there goes That's your the way revenue I see stream. It, yeah. There goes your revenue stream right yep. down the... This is... See this graph right here? Oh, God. Here There's comes the graph. <laughs> <laughs> then, oh, new game came out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. New game came out. It just sucks because, like, we're, like... I don't know. I'm really passionate about the whole, like, Nintendo thing. And it just, like... I didn't. You know what bothered me is like I never, I never expected this from them. I miss playing. Yeah, Zelda Nintendo games. was probably one of the last companies. People yeah, always Zelda games. Stuff. People always ask like, oh, what are you gonna do? You know, it's it can't last forever. It's like, well, I'm just gonna get a real job then. I yeah. mean, it's Fuck. it's not. I don't see it as that surprising because they, like I said, they're kind of out of touch. They haven't, yeah, yeah. even yeah. though they it's haven't just, been as involved in the community. At the know, same time, they haven't. Know. They don't. They don't do much with the community true, like true, as well. True. Like they just kind of like they're just the company that's there. Like they don't. It seems Go like all out. it seems like they're kind of rooted in the past a little bit because, like James yeah, said, they're, even they're even Rockstar cool. has eventually come around yeah. and they have a statement, or at least they had a statement on their website, like, yeah, you know, do LPs, whatever commentary, yeah. just don't upload only cutscenes, yeah, and that's, you're fine. That's just stupid. And they're like, we have the right to take it down at any time, but so far, I'd, I don't think they've really done that. I, I had talked, no, I had and Rockstar to, uh, is like a company that's just now getting into the community scene, like as I can see, like through the being social smart. club and stuff like that. They have community play dates on like. Even older games, they still do. Really? Like they, they have a, you know, they're getting together a tight community. They're smart. From what they're, they're doing. They're smart. And like yeah. any, just to any company out there producing games, or whatever. Like, you, you go against the community, you're shooting yourself again. Like you're shooting yourself in the leg. Yeah. Like that's just dumb. Final word. What's gonna happen with this entire situation? Nintendo's going we, down if they don't change their ways. I'm not. Right I'm not we don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I, actually, I don't. I don't know what'll happen. You don't, you don't know. know. Actually, no. Uh, yeah, it's very quiet. You can't hear that. Wait, no, I play you don't quiet. know. Oh. You don't know. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> <laughs> but no. Also, These just just so fail. you know how this affects us, we were supposed to do uh, Diddy Kong Racing next. Uh, you guys picked for head to head Diddy Kong Racing, Sheamus against Nova, and uh, that's not happening. Yep. So it's gonna be other other two games, or I'll, I'll come up with something funny so, so they so they could get angry at each because other. Because of Nintendo. Yep. yep. <laughs>
I, I just like the fact, um, before we get on the next one, I just like the fact that some companies like the like uh, Todd at High Resin, there's another guy from um, a PR agency who's saying, if you guys want to play our games and post them on YouTube, here's the links. Yeah, there are a they, lot of devs tweeting out. Yeah, like, I've, I've, seen seen that. That. I've seen that. Um, I've seen that. There was a giant poster. Like all, somebody was saying, these are all the game companies that you have to, that you can play. And they were like, yes, and what you need, some of them didn't even tell but you. But I think that's more so for people that don't have a partnership. Like, correct, yeah. correct. I think that's like for, pe for, no, they, for people they were that saying don't have a partnership. Monetize, you can monetize all you want. You have my Yeah, for people do that don't have a partnership, stuff, like they can, you can still, if you don't have a partnership, I guess you could still monetize like a, like a Minecraft thing or something like that. Like, we could still do it regardless, like, because we're part know, partnered. Yeah, we're part of a network. So I think that we can... We can. We still have a lot more like wiggle less room. lean or yeah, more room. lenient boundaries than. At the normal. end of the day, despite all the bad news with Nintendo, no matter what, there's always going to be companies and developers that will openly say, "Play our game, monetize it, do whatever. Mm -hmm. It's a good game. We know you're going to enjoy it, and we know your fans are going to enjoy it, and we're going to get sales from that." There's, and they're there's going always, to succeed. There's always going to be because, the, like I was saying earlier, the COO of uh, Hyrus tweeted out yeah, like the link. And he's like, you know, if this is true, then it's. High res is all about move. community. They told yeah. us that. No, they built uh, their game. They told us that at What packs. if suddenly League just said, okay, no more streams, no more YouTube <laughs> oh, videos. Oh, we're, we're only doing we're only doing tournament streams officially. Not only on would Twitch. League go down, Twitch would go down as well. <laughs> <laughs> like it's 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 a smart idea to to have that. Like if you have a good game and stuff, you want people to experience it. I mean, League is huge, but what if they said, okay. We're only doing one official stream, no streamers, no YouTube videos, nothing. That's All it. All that shit would be done. Like, like how that was at first. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I think with, like, closed betas, they don't usually allow that. I don't, I don't know what. They do happened, now. They yeah. do now. NDA's okay. lifted now. Right. Is it? Yeah. All right, cool. Usually there's an NDA in yeah. place for a little bit, and then, like, after a certain date, they're like, okay. Not you the way they went thing. about it, though. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I, I don't know terrible. how they No, I mean, they could have worded that. Like we're talking about Marvel heroes, but like <laughs> back at PAX or whatever, like they could have worded that a lot better than what Wait, that can other we, guy can you did. Stream it like, now too? Are you, you should yeah. be able to. Yeah. What did they say? They, oh, like they the guy was just like the it. first guy that was talking to Sly was really nice and everything like that, and then the guy that you know came up afterwards was kind of a prick about it. And oh, he was cop, just bad like, cop. You know, yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. He was like, you know, <laughs> we'll pull your streams down and shit like that, and you know, we have no ETA on the NDA, and you know, just yeah, don't fucking do it. We've been in the streams, and we'll see them streaming our game before the NDA. But the thing was, they said, yeah, they go in there and they would actually type in the chat and like, you know, I guess I don't know, I don't want to say egg them on, but they would say like, you know, you guys broke the NDA, you know, why not just fucking shut it down like why do you gotta go the extra mile just take go it be like, into their stream fucking type in the chat it's like taunting them and like right. why yeah, the right, fuck yeah. just be like hey guys the NDA is not up can yeah. you please take the stream down or, or we're gonna they could be a Switch, lot nicer like, about it yeah. and then, like at yeah, least that that, that one guy was most YouTubers aren't gonna be dick like if you say you know we don't want this up right now can you please take it down we'll probably take it down but yeah, if you're like, okay, all, yeah, all we'll you do need that. to do like unless unless you got yourself a big cock that it feels entitled to like publish something that you obviously say, hey, don't publish it, then fuck that guy. But majority of people, or at least YouTubers, are like, yeah, I fucked up. If like, you don't want it, then, yeah, yeah, you know, well, I'll, I'll respect what you want. Even, I, I, even on my topics. sense, I'm like, I'm sorry, I apologize. I, I, if I genuinely did not know, I'm like, I, I really didn't know. It's my fault, and that's it. That's yeah. the end of it. But I would say this is a good way. Yeah, this is a good way to go about it. In yeah. a bad way, obviously, but... <laughs> Very. Uh, so but there is the, good news with the bad news. Either way, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go and uh, gonna, Nintendo has a preference uh, presence at E3. I'm gonna go. Shit they're gonna, gonna have a press conference at <laughs> Best Buy. Shit right in their booth. <laughs> you can go at the press conference at Best Buy, like right down the yeah. street. Yeah. You know? <laughs> oh man, look at this! Oh. This is Nintendo's E3. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know what they're doing, but man, that was that, that was best of luck to everybody. That was heated. That was that was a heated tune. Topic, so like, next topic. Uh, your topic was more so: is this a real job or not? <laughs> yeah, that was, it, 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 it ties in a little bit. It tied yeah. in. It, it, kind of, yeah. it did tie in. I, For the people that were saying that the YouTube. And I just I wanted to bring kind of like knowledge to everybody, to the fans and everything. Like it just just wanted to put that out there. I, I feel like I've been filled with knowledge. Thank so. you. I mean, I'm filled to the too. brim. I'm about to explode with knowledge <laughs> all over your face. It's gonna be like, pff, knowledge. You. My throbbing knowledge. Oh Look god! Knowledge. My throbbing knowledge hammer is ready to pound. <laughs> Creamy white knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the next topic is the uh, the guys that. Uh, Do we seriously have enough time for all this shit? Well, they're they're gonna be pretty pretty skip a few of them. Are they're they're probably mostly no, six more topics left. Uh, right. Yeah, this one will be quick. Uh, so the guys at CD Projekt Red released the Red Kit, which is the the cool engine that they built. The that Witcher me and Dan seen last year at uh, Gamescom. It's, I downloaded it. Close enough. Yeah, yeah it's, it's close to a, a full year later. 
I downloaded it, and so far, like, it is, it's awesome because it's very, very similar to UDK. Like, there's a lot of similarities, and that will make it a lot Better easier Better or to worse, in. though, like, stable-wise. Oh, that was a, uh, a cringing face. I, I, I haven't really like gotten into it enough to know, but I need some more time. I'd say UDK is a lot more optimized and a little cleaner looking, but it's still pretty cool. <laughs> it's and ugly. The, the engine looks really good. The engine looks really good though, so it, that's pretty cool to try and screw around with and see what I can do. And for people that don't know, that's the uh, that's the Witcher engine. Yeah, I said, yeah, it said the Witcher. The Witcher. I still need to go through those games and play them. Witcher. I haven't played the first one yet. I should probably do that. I played a little bit of the first one, a little bit of the second one, but um, it's gonna be hard to go back to the Witcher one because it's like super poopy. Yeah, it's very, <laughs> it's very, it's very not streamlined. Uh, so this is it this Tuesday the Xbox <laughs> yes, reveal. Yes, it is stream. this Tuesday. Uh, so yes. you guys should go. Uh, well, I'm sure we'll be watching. You it guys are going to be streaming. Are they going to be on Best so Buy? No. Okay. You guys no are Best Buy presents Nintendo. for you guys Xbox? will be streaming that day. So then we should like watch what about it. Right well, it's like the Nintendo one. Yeah. Didn't we like Fries stream and then right after that we watched it? Nintendo has Best oh, Buy. I don't know. The like, so we have it written Fries, down for stream on Monday. Huh? Or New Age? Why is it written down? New Age. <laughs> what, can, what was he talking about? Stream? Oh, okay. The Xbox. The Xbox <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So they're gonna be revealing that. Probably are they? They're not showing any games out. Uh, Call of Duty. They just said that they're. Ho I, no, that was. You know what? That you, was Sony that said they were holding off games for E3 for the most part. Are they gonna have hardware? Xbox, E3? Yeah, they no, were, Xbox. Yeah. X, the reason I know this is because I've seen T Martin and he always puts hashtag this amount of days for new Xbox, and then he puts another tweet hashtag this amount of days, which is the same thing as the Xbox. I'm like, all right, then both of them are coming the same fucking day. Probably, yeah. No one cares about some exclusive. I, I think I think the release Ghost. of the Xbox and the new PlayStation will be. A lot more prolific oh. than the Wii U. Oh, I think I, just I, the, just I, a little it, bit it maybe. Might, it you might know, fuck me usually how, what happens. It might fuck me how little attention it got like in the beginning. Usually, like, what happens so is the newer bad. consoles sell better than the older ones, except in the Wii U's case. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. So, I don't really know what happened. Like they just. <laughs> I, I they really wanted got, to like it. I think they could have got. Just want a console or just a controller, end. and that's it. Nothing gimmicky. The thing that made it hard. That's why the PC's doing better. Because it's just mouse and keyboard. Yeah. Yeah. The thing that made it hard to <laughs> do Wii U stuff is that people always wanted to see like what was going on on the tablet, and there's no yeah, real way yeah, to. No way you would have to like jerry rig, you know, Another a camera, camera. So you and have then a camera, a camera in camera, and then the capture. And then you'd have to edit it all and make weird. sure that it, it was just kind yeah, of an annoyance. Um, just to I see think like they could have, in general, like with the next console, I think they could have got more out of the PS3 though before switching mm. to a new console. You think? I don't think they got. As much all as, of it as, out of as it. Much I, yeah, I'd say I'd agree with that. Like, with the with their well, what are you, what are you mean? Yeah, he's fucking mowing the lawn again. Someone's mowing the lawn. Maybe he's mowing the lawn for us. I'll close the door. I'll close the door. No, speaking of which, someone did come by and ask about that, so I'll talk to you about that later. Someone asked to mow our lawn, like a kid. It's a neighbor. Should have let him. It's probably his parents. I didn't know over. when you say that there's supposed probably to be a fucking people. cheaper than these other people. All right, all right, all right. That's fuck racist. yourself. These yeah, he was Spanish. He was Spanish. You fucking racist. <laughs> Hola. Essay? Wow. That's yeah. what you said. Wow, you essay. Like, I'm, I'm capitalizing what you're saying. Hello, Poppy. your lano. Poppy, essay. You gotta do the kissy kissy. Yeah, I think with the exclusives. Hey, the, the, hey, Poppy, Annika. The, the PlayStation exclusives hey, are usually like really oh, okay. good looking, so I think they probably si. could have got more si. out of it. <laughs> Por favor. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what <laughs> happens. Plus. I'm kind of yeah, excited. So. Uh, we are also doing, uh, with Twitch, we're doing a, a Warframe. Uh, Warframe stream here on Monday and then next Saturday. Is that Saturday or Sunday? That's Sunday. Sunday. So Sunday. next Sunday. Um, it's going to be whoever, I guess whoever's around to do. It's Again with like this a, shit. Again, the, our, 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 ladies and gentlemen, our leader. You know, I, I usually show, show up, up and then, you know, whoever else shows up. I didn't even know what was going <laughs> on. <laughs> Whoever wants to show up and show up. Yeah, yeah. If you want to do it. Do so it. we'll be no, streaming no. those two days and um, it. playing some Warframe. It looks pretty looks pretty nifty. I'll so. just ask Alex. Hey, speaking of which, before we get to the next topic oh, for the PlayStation thing. <laughs> no, I wanted to say this while while we were here because this just uh, this just came up, uh, I want to say a few oh, weeks ago. Another Sly rant coming up. It probably is going to be another Sly rant. Well, this <laughs> might be a Sly rant. That, that one is, yeah. You know what? I'm no, gonna, I want you to rant that for last. last. I want you to oh, yeah, rant for yeah, you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That one's going to be a rant. I'm going to rant for so you. So this is probably going to be another rant for am Sly. I, am I the rant master here? Right now. Today, in, in, this, in this creature rant talk. Rant master flex. They call you me. are the go against the grain person in this in this creature talk. Actually, well, you were you were for us in the uh, thing. but Well, actually, no. That's, is it still technically against the grain if he's... 
for just us. Just go. The majority still. Yeah, just well, set yeah, it I up. So. Whatever. But yeah. Cool. Uh, so yeah, a few weeks ago, uh, there was an, an interview with uh, Sucker Punch. Okay. And uh, it turns out they used the good ending for Infamous as canon. The Cole is ending. dead. Really? Yes. Wow. Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> We'll see. I don't know why he's happy that Cole is dead. I am right! Because he's right. Because he's right, yeah, because he was because right he... all that time. <laughs> I am fucking right! For the longest time, me and Seamus were saying how illogical it is. Oh. How illogical it would be if Cole was dead. And they ran with that ending. But the thing was, their explanation was that even the lightning bolt hitting his casket was still an, uh, like a cop-out in case they needed to bring him back. Like, they could still bring him back. But they wanted to, I guess, I don't, I don't want to say phase him out or whatever, but, like, they went with him being dead, and that was That's it. Nice. Like, they I moved on to somebody maybe, else. I did not know about this. Maybe. I don't know about it. It's either. Max Mercer. <laughs> but the All thing is, again. I was reading somebody's. Max Mercer? <laughs> Alex, Alex Mercer? Mercer. Max Mercer. Max Mercer. Max Mercer. It's like Max Payne's Max, brother. Max Payne. I thought you were legitimately saying that, like as if like Alex Mercer had a brother or something like that. <laughs> Billy the Babe Man. I really games. wanted them to go with the little hint that they had that they had said that Cole had a brother. I really wanted them to run with that and just be like, you know, the next character is Cole's brother or that's something. Be, like that. If he was really dead, not Wait, a so random guy. Yeah, they had that random weird, blurb. Because I kind of it's a brand. Yeah, it's a brand new guy. Uh, yeah. It's set. I think like five, five to seven years after Cole is dead, and I guess the the, the people that are chasing wait, wait, after wait, the wait, new wait, guy. Wait, 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 wait! But if they go with, if they went with the good ending, how are there more mutants or more? Uh... There's a few, I guess that that they he didn't exterminate all of them. Oh, I guess. oh, I know. That's that, what I was that, saying. That like, does it, not make sense. I'm sorry. That's what I said from a logical standpoint. I suppose I'm happy that I got my point right. I I don't like that. The point that you were defending, you no longer want. <laughs> No, I, I now like, you feel sad that Cole's I, not. I, I, no, done. it's more logical that, that 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 they would run with the bad ending because as there's canon. More people, because there's more people. There's more. Uh, or because you know, like he became you know the beast or whatever, and like you know maybe that could have been the enemy or whatever. Yeah, but like someone down. broke it down and was saying that the good ending is actually the bad ending. Like that he, uh, I guess Cole. What does he do in the ending? Like does he? He he basically kills like a lot of innocent uh, no, people. He no, what, he, what it was it was a it was a choice between a. He yeah. kills himself to kill no, no, all the no. conduits, he, he, right? He, yeah, he kills all the conduits to save uh, because uh, all the normal people were infected. Yeah. And uh, it, it yeah. Was either they would become conduits or they would die. That's what I mean. Like in in the bad <laughs> ending, he, all the human he beings. kills all those people. But at the end of the day, <clears throat> the bad ending is kind of like a greater good picture. Like because, he kills yeah. he kills everybody for the greater good because now there's not you know anything going. On. Like that seems to be a better choice for just, canon just, ending. I just want him to be tied into it. He's not. He's dead. Know, he's dead. He's just... gone. He's a skeleton. You guys spoiled this entire series for me. Yep. Well, series has been <laughs> out for like years, <laughs> though. Like, by the way, the only thing years. I'll ever know about... Banjo-Kazooie dies in the end. <laughs> Why well, say so you know? The only thing oh, I'll ever know things. about the series is that that guy that gave the speech at the uh, the PS3 press conference... Oh, God. Oh, that was amazing. The guy who gave the yeah. long ass like you he know. This, you'll like, never feel safe. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. It was, it was funny. In 1972, I attended a rally where the police turned on the crowd. Mm -hmm. That was the first time I never thought I could trust oh a pl God. like a authority figure. <laughs> it was funny. His like. What if you can't the trust the something? authorities? Yeah, what like, if there's yeah. somebody who can get through security that is the bomb? They oh don't have God. a bomb. They are the weapon. Like, <laughs> all right. That guy was so into his yeah, message. Yeah. Jerry. Okay, yeah, and here's know. here's infamous, by the way. I, 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 I trust in Sucker Punch, but I don't I don't I don't think that was a good way. I thought they should have just kept with the bad I, yeah. I, when seeing the trailer and how there was like new people with like the power so I'm like, well, it makes sense that the bad ending or the the red well I'm gonna call it the red ending because essentially you Red ending. The red and the blue. Yeah, the red and the blue. So I will call the red ending. Add the, a green the one, in there, you got mass effect. The, <laughs> yeah. the one makes more sense because now in this new one, there's like a random dude and all these people with different powers. So I'm like, all right, so the conduits actually did take over. Well, it makes yeah, sense. and they have that enforcement thing in place because of Cole, and that's just the people yeah. that are fading, uh, chasing. But now, and like, stuff like well, in this one, if they're going with the blue one, it makes no sense. Like, what? Like, the new game doesn't make sense. He might at come all, back in a prequel. Actually. You never know. They uh, had that lightning bolt at the, at the end for for a reason. Alternate like, game. Dramatic effect. Cop, cop out, Alternate reality. 
So they could, they still could have chosen the good ending and still had Cole come back, like because of the lightning bolt. They they yeah. put that there for a reason. They could have done that, but they just chose to leave him dead. I don't, I don't know what they're what. I don't what know. Maybe, sad you know, maybe they had the voice actor and they didn't want. Well, to they changed him from the first. Design. Yeah, so yeah. now they got yeah, they fucking like, new like, guy again. We, we, like, oh, we gotta find a new guy. Fuck it, just kill him. Leave him dead. Done, whatever. Fuck it. Two, new guy. Two, two, two and done. That's what I say. That's what I say. Not gonna get me much. three times. It's really strange <laughs> what they're doing. I like the premise behind the new character. What they were saying, like you know, the smoke and stuff like that. He also smoke has guy? he has chains, I guess, that he uses like you know, kind of like a wind shit. He's like a mix of a bunch of different gods and shit, I guess. But it, I mean, I, I there isn't yeah. really. I mean, there's not much fucking superheroes that have the power of smoke, so I could see what they would do with that. But I don't. What like about it. what about smoke? Smoke from Mortal Kombat. Yeah. He's totally a superhero. Oh yeah, no, because every day <laughs> there's fighters so like you know Sonya has the ability to have. I just said about. superhero. He is superhero. A, he's a superhero. He's not a superhero. He's <laughs> Mortal Kombat. Smoke guy. is a fucking superhero. He participates in this tournament that they fucking well, get to he, suck he... Shao Kahn's dick. <laughs> and that's, what they, that's, what they, that's what they're fighting does for. That, he's a superhero. That, what 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 makes a superhero? Does he, have, does he have to go and fly and help people in buildings and shit? I'm like just that? saying well-known superheroes. Oh, there's not right. many that are like. Smoke. I have the power of smoke. True, true. With that, with that, yeah. Okay. okay. With that logic, yes, I'll give you that. But there's not that many people that, if they I said there's not that many that. people that use smoke as power, then you could have said, yeah, well, what about you? <laughs> <laughs> but, <All> right. yeah. <laughs> you joined in with that <laughs> one. Either way, uh, at the end of the day, <laughs> Coles did. So what's next? So I was right. It's it's depressing. Depressing. So I was right. Very You're depressing. Right. So I was yeah. right. No one cares yeah. about from us. You All don't. Right. You don't, and you're super happy. They gotta still run with the brother thing. Yeah. So, Metro, Last Light. What the fuck? Why are you skipping? Because I'm saving that one for the end. Didn't he say that to you and you were like, yeah? No, I didn't yeah, say, he did that. say that. Oh. Either, yeah. I don't fucking agree with him. Oh, okay. <laughs> Unless I'm drugged. <laughs> did you drug me? I may have slipped something in his drink. So. Those so water is a little right there. Uh, fizzy. Yeah. Metro, Last Light. Who all has played it? Not no one. Either. James has played it. I have played it. <laughs> I have it. I've been thinking about recording it, but I don't know. I said initially, because I was going to record it, but very slow start, I guess. But really? you said that that's the tone of the entire game. It, uh, no, it, so it was pretty much the same tone. As it's the a other very one. slow it's, They turned game. it even more like stealthy than, uh, yeah. than the first game. You can still do you know, like the run and gun stuff, but they make it more But there's But there's not much yeah, to run and gun that. through. It's a real, like, even if you were to run and gun, because I've gotten caught, like, a few times where I'm trying to be stealthy and stuff. It's like, you know, four or five enemies, and then you're done, like, and then you go to the next area. But it's a really, like, it's good, but it's just, like, it's, I don't know, it's a really slow-paced game. Save like save you, the... you start out, like, in a tutorial, and you get through that. And then, like, it's not really a spoiler or whatever, but, like, the guy get, ends up being, like, captured or whatever. But okay. then you feel like you're in a tutorial again. Like, it's just, it, it's like... What? It's tutorial. A really, tutorial. We double the... Twi- it more turns into a stealth yeah. tutorial. Yeah, yeah it's like a stealth tutorial. It's like, it's like a... <laughs> they, it's, it's really slow paced. A lot more so in this game, they focus on human combat, where in the first game, there's a lot more beast combat. Yeah. But there is still more, uh, like, they save all the, like, crazy shootouts and stuff for when you're facing animals and mutants and stuff. Mm-hmm. Which is kind of like the which is like the first game, but they incorporate yeah. more of a stealth element when you're fighting and working your way through. Like I don't know how enemies. how how many like because I got like I said I got two hours in and I still felt like it was a really slow paced game. I know, yeah, that's four hours. That's, that's, that's like so Assassin's Creed. Two three. hours. Yeah. There, there's a few. There get there's a point. Where but he says that's the tone of the game. I never I never played the Jesus first Metro, Christ, so I played a little bit of it. Man. It's good, but it's, you, it's, just, it's got this like just slow methodical pace to it. Yeah, where it's, it's just it's, like it's just the way it's supposed to be. Does it? Just, just I don't know, as a person that hasn't even played any of that. It doesn't fuck with anything, but I was just does like, it, like it, while recording it, like I just find myself like I, I wouldn't talk. For yeah, long yeah. You, of time. you like focus on something like trying because not it's to be so seen, slow paced. You, like, you stop talking for a bit. It'll literally be like 15 minutes for you to get from like A to B, and it's like, wh- what do you talk about in that? in that span of time like Damn. it's so slow that there's not really you can't fill the gap in unless but, you're like but, but now now the real question comes if you weren't recording the game yeah start playing with yourself or something <laughs> like hey guys i'm playing with myself right now <laughs> i'm playing with my knowledge hammer <laughs> <laughs> for the 15 but minutes if you were not recording it like just like if you were not to yeah, record you can get it. into it and stuff uh, no, that's what i'm saying it's, it's good something that'd it's good. be really fun like when i first played through metro i didn't record it and i had a blast playing it because it's it's a really cool um, 
it it takes place in the like the subway system of Moscow. So you're like going mm-hmm. in between and like in all the tunnels and there's like in like different kinds of mutants and stuff and uh, like a bunch of like they they pretty much made weapons so they're like really unique weapons that That's they put cool. together kind of stuff and it's it's pretty it's pretty nifty so by I the really way like that the, fucking and it's off of sucks. huh that, that fucking dude cutting the grass unless he'd him. cut our lawn then we'd be okay yeah. see there's a fucking guy over there cutting his lawn now there's a guy in the back cutting yeah. the lawn no, it's just like, I think it's the it's same ev- guy. It's like a call to arms. One lawnmower goes off. Everyone's like, go, go, go. Everybody, the hype, hype, bring all the mow. Start fucking hearing everybody mowing their shit. People start cutting trees. Oh, fuck it. It's fucking ridiculous. I like, it's uh, Metro's. Metro's pretty fun. I like it. Ooh, like I heard it was good. I just didn't know it was like so slow. It has, sadly, there was some performance issues. It was badly optimized for my brand of graphics card, the ATIs, and I didn't download the driver, so there's a couple really bad, like, kind of like Dead Island. Not quite Dead Island, like... <laughs> I've been I've been looking for drivers. I was dropping like, to, like, t- ten frames in some portions. Ooh. Like, the one of the portions was you're going through this, like, this spoilers, place. Spoilers! It's not a spoiler. Spoilers, spoilers. You're going through, like, a swamp, mm-hmm. and if you fall in the water, it looks like, uh, kind of like when you're going through the... They were going through the Dead Marshes in Lord of the Rings. So it's kind of like that. You fall in the water, and there's a bunch of stuff that keeps jumping out of the water at you. And, uh, one big monster that keeps on get, trying to get you, too. So it's like something you need to be ready to shoot, but I'm lagging at like 10 frames, and I'm <laughs> missing all over the oh place with my, with my double-barreled shotgun. So I'm like, oh, there goes two shots. Now he's right in my face. That but, sucks. So I, I just downloaded the newest driver, so hopefully that's fixed. But. Yeah, I don't think Hopefully. I've seen any new drivers for Dead Island, so <laughs> whenever we get back to that, I'm sure we'll find another Dead Zone. <laughs> yeah. That'll be great. Yeah, it'll be in trouble. Um, there was uh, Arkham Origins um, little trailer. teaser trailer. Thing. Yeah, I watched it right before we started doing this, and it's just it's essentially like a blur trailer. It Jordan was saying it, it seems like segments of a full blur trailer. Yeah, it's a teaser, so I assume that they... But have... I don't know. They've done little things like that for like... Um, Force Unleashed, where it was just like a brief little thing. I'm going to give it about a 75% chance there's a full trailer. Full trailer. trailer. It's <laughs> essentially just like 30 seconds of Batman fighting an, uh, an assassin, like with a sword. He has The guy has a sword, and he's just fighting. It's Deathstroke. Him. But wait, yeah. Is it? Was it Deathstroke? I yes. It was Deathstroke. Okay. Was Deathstroke. It is. Wait, the one, there was it, a picture it, with... Was it, what's the cut in between? It was like yeah. yellow and black. Yeah, that's uh, okay. Deathstroke. Anyway. That's, uh, that's, uh, it's an assassin. Isn't, isn't that also Slade from uh, Teen Titans? That's what I always thought. Yeah, yeah. that's what I was uh, I was known to, to believe. I wanted to say when they released publicity stills, Sweet. there was multiple of those guy, that guy, though. That's why I was thinking oh. it was an assassin, mm-hmm. but... Like, I could be wrong. Army. I could be wrong. Anyway, so, like, it's just 40 seconds of him fighting that guy in the end. And James pointed out, like, how the fact that he doesn't look any younger, really, <laughs> than Arkham City Batman. He looks maybe a couple years that's younger. That's what they said, maybe. that they were getting rid of Conroy. For yeah, that's what they I think he looks kind of older, to be honest. Like, he, uh, yeah, well, Jordan was saying maybe that it's like, well, he has a bit of, like, a 5 o'clock shadow yeah, going on. But sense. Jordan was saying maybe, like, it, it, that's the beginning of the game. It'll start off with a flashback. And he's like... I remember when I was five years younger and it sounded completely different. But James, James was saying, well, wouldn't it be Ken, Kevin Conroy then at the beginning? <laughs> yeah, it would be. But, yeah, we'll I, don't, I don't know. I'm, for some reason, like, James is wearing me down and actually, like, starting to make me think that this game isn't going to be that great. <laughs> if you can't wear yourself <laughs> down, like, He's with everything that's been announced on that. I don't know. Like, I, I still have high hopes. I hope it's good, but, like, I don't know. Let's go play fucking Batman Begins or whatever on the Xbox One or something <laughs> like that. You want to get your Batman fix. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, it looks all right, but I don't know. I need more to get me excited other than Batman just swinging around a little bit with Wait a guy with the sword. sword. I'm almost certain they had... Uh, I love the like Blur the trailer for Arkham said, City. Stay tuned for the Facebook, uh, on Facebook for, like, the 24th or something and release the full thing. Uh, okay. I well, thought I saw that. It, it might not have been for that. But um, you're wrong. Yep. So we'll see. Wrong. Let's see. Uh, this one I actually just got from Twitter. Somebody had uh, sent for a thing. E- EA. Yep. Apparently, EA they doing something have good. Done something good. Wait, what? And demolished online passes. Wait, yeah, that's what they, great. You know, they implement something that now other companies are throwing in the mix, <laughs> and then they take theirs away. Like, oh, you know, it's, they're it's, setting that's standards. That's their overall done. plan to fuck them over. Yeah, Didn't they say they were getting rid of uh, the DRM or whatever it is? I don't know. I I thought they said something about that too. That. But, but for, for people that don't know, I, the online passes—it's the online passes when you when buy like DRM, a used game and you need to. 
That's why I was the DRM telling. is oh, you yeah. have to be connected online yeah. whenever you're playing oh, a game. Like, I'll put the new Xbox. Yeah, really the like online that. passes would be included when you bought a game. You would have to enter it to be able like to need play for multiplayer. Speed. But if you bought it used, it, it wouldn't come with it. You'd so have you'd to pay have to for it. Pay DLC, like it'd be a DLC kind of thing. It'd be so. like 240 points or yeah, it's just a way to kind of get more money. So that apparently they've taken that out, which is you know that's shockingly something that EA has done right. Someone is, someone on Twitter was saying that EA and Nintendo Everybody swapped. Everybody gets one, right? <laughs> yeah, EA and Nintendo swapped. <laughs> <laughs> That's what someone had said. <laughs> oh oh they tweeted me, they're like, look what EA did. Nintendo's the new EA. Wow. Someone took a big shot at them. Um, but yeah, another thing. Uh, oh god, this, this one is a hundred percent confirmed now. A hundred percent confirmed. No bullshit. I guess I should say ninety-nine point nine. No, there you go. There there aren't any n- unforeseen oh, 100%. consequences. hundred percent. Z has a plane ticket to come out here after E3. Woo! Hey! I'm gonna touch their nipples. I'm gonna grab them and twist them. What? What? Nothing. We're gonna well, play now Z's not coming out. I don't even want to come now. Uh, oh, there goes that point. All right. <laughs> Fuck. He he exuded his what? <laughs> Time to cancel I don't have tickets. I don't have a return flight, so as far as I know, I'm there indefinitely. <laughs> We're not letting him go. <laughs> you have to get your own way Preacher back. Preacher Carl's going to kidnap him into his closet and just oh, have fun with him. He's gonna <laughs> stuff him in with lemur. We're just in here. <laughs> in the little box. In the in the closet, <laughs> and he's just gonna be like, no, <laughs> no. Uh, um, so, see. so our last topic of the day. See, we blew through again. those other ones. Yeah, I'm not gonna say anything. I knew those were. Good. You so had we to. Went, I was uh, waiting for this rant. Like you. We went last night now. to play laser tag. Where at? Uh, laser quest. Okay. <laughs> it was it was a laser quest that was over. Guess, and, by the way, guess who's never getting my business again? Laser, laser quest. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So um, is that the general consensus? Like it sucked, or was that I just? Thought, did yeah, you I not go either, Seamus? No, I didn't go. Uh, okay. So, I knew going in, like I had an idea. It's like okay, I, like I, I haven't played laser tag before. in a long ass time. Yeah, I played it like once when so I was ten. So I want to see, you know, how, how it's evolved, how the landscape has changed. <laughs> And Let's just say that we saw some kids walk through the door, reeking of certain substances. Oh yeah, there was and <laughs> cocaine, <laughs> fucking booze, and everything, man. These guys, no, right, hardcore cocaine. All right, I'm gonna, cocaine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to. Talk no, now right. he's talking. No, yeah. you have to shut up. You don't get to talk at Let all. Let him talk. I want to hear it. No, I always okay, like so a good rant. So they came in as soon as we we knew that the the environment changed, the mood just swapped. <sighs> It was the call- liquor it was, a was call better. Du- the parties were quicker. It was a Call of Duty <laughs> lobby after they oh, walked no. in. <laughs> and, uh, and it was it was an Iron Man game, which is thirty minutes compared to like the regular fifteen minutes. So oh, that's exhausted. why I felt so long. Yeah, I was exhausted after it because I'm way out of shape, and there's ramps in there. But there's ramps. It, mm-hmm. It's three levels. High. Soon, but yeah, as soon as we got yeah, in yeah, there, they like, were. I felt like too. they got inside the, the like the little prep area, and they all lined up at the door, know, and they got three. right in there, it it and they got three. ready. They they knew the rules. They've been there before. They went in. They grabbed their gear. They rushed off into the. So arena. you guys were the noobs. We were the yeah, noobs. Like, you guys have funny. Noobs? We were the casual. It was noobs. funny because when we were in the instruction room, I kept saying to Jordan, "I was like, man, the little kids are gonna get fucked up." I was like, "I'm just going after them. Like, I'm gonna fuck them little kids. I'm just gonna shoot the shit out of." Them. There's a few little kids. Hello, yeah. kids, man. They fucked me up in there. <laughs> like, they're little assholes. They just run around. Take that fucker. Yeah. You're usually not Pong. looking. You have your gun up. Yeah, you're like kind of at a... you can't see them. They're down here when they yeah. come around the corner. You get shot and you're like, and then you look down. They they're fucking sitting there. Scamper. Yeah. They scamper away off into the corners. You can't but the thing was, like, the chest and the fucking back plates did not work for shit. I had more success shooting someone's gun. Because they the had a sensor on the gun, yeah. go for. like There's then the chest and the back. Because I'd sit there and be like, pew pew pew, and it's like yeah, I don't and know then what they the fuck shoot you once in the gun, and you're like, okay, okay, that's great. It's fucking ridiculous. But before <laughs> before Sly gets into his rant, whatever, <laughs> there was this one. There was a funny ass moment, I swear, with Jordan, <laughs> and and. So, I, like, I caught up with him, and we were just kind of, like, tagging each other back and forth or whatever. Oh, and he was just like, you know, stop, stop shooting me or whatever. And, like, <laughs> I kept running after him. I was like, come on. I was like, let's do some tack inserts and, like, you know, put it down oh, and just keep man. shooting the shit out of each other. And when we Gonna get that tiger cam. He ran up. He ran up, and he goes around this corner. And there, were two, there were two black guys that were there, and they were camping pretty hard. The, sub, the guys that reached up the substances. Jordan walks up. He stops dead in his tracks, and I'm watching him, like, from a distance. <laughs> <laughs> it's like seeing a fucking bat out of hell. He was like, oh. <laughs> it's just like he doesn't want to go into the corner with the two black guys <laughs> they, that are there. They were, 
call it. They were doing call outs. They're like, oh, there's one over there. Watch your back. When I came around the corner, he's like, watch your back, buddy. He's coming around. And he got up and he started shooting me. And I was like, oh, come on. He like, fucking, he just goes up. I don't even know if he shot. I don't even know if he shot at them. Like, he just turns around. He just go, he drops his gun to his side. He comes around. He just starts walking towards me. He goes around the corner and just goes off. And I'm just looking at him. I was like, what were you fucking scared? Like, what were you doing? He got fucking frightened. Like, <laughs> they were doing Call of Duty callouts, the and they fucking were look on his face. He said B was domination. Like, they were Point yelling B. Tango down and Tango suck up. I was just like, yeah, I would have been fucking scared too. And they were sitting there the entire time, just what right of, next to each other. One of them was wearing a fucking tank top, and he was pretty. I mean, he was pretty big. Like, I would have been like, fuck that. Tell I'm that like, guy he's cutting in line. Like, I'm not even gonna shoot at you, man. I'll just fucking walk off the other way. Let's make sure I will not come back to this corner for the rest of the game. This reminds me of the Comic Con line. Where it's like, tell that guy he's cutting in line, yeah, Jordan. Guy, yeah, big yeah. buff guy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, like, right. he, like, just imagine him like running and then just like he just gets stopped in his track. Stop, just, like, I, just, I just get shot from like ten different angles <laughs> yeah, and I'm just like, starts okay. walking off. It's just like and I, they're I, doing call outs to each other, like, watch your back, buddy, watch your back. I'm not fucking with them guys. Fuck that. I never like, back there. It was terrible. <laughs> I kept yelling at him while he was walking off. I was like, Were you scared? <laughs> <laughs> scared Jordan? <laughs> what happened? What happened there in that corner? What happened? Those guys like, they scared the shit out of you. <laughs> oh god, that was hilarious though. Like his poor guy. Like I could I mean and you're you're so tall too, like you were probably taller than them. He was one of the tallest. There was one person taller than him. Yeah, but it's like only one. <laughs> They would have beat the shit out of you if you fucking <laughs> shot them. You fucking shoot at them, they'll fuck you up. Like, yeah, they're gonna be like, hey, what are you doing? <laughs> you would have fucked up their groove and everything. Yeah, that would have been it. And they, they, after the match, they lined up. They were waiting for their scorecards, man. They were, every single other person. They we probably still We kind of all went off and. They wanted you know, to see how many nothing. times they shot you. <laughs> 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 yeah, <laughs> pretty funny. Yeah, they pretty just good. the try hard meter was off the charts for that. It In general, it was, yeah. which is what kind of leads into Sly's. Uh, <laughs> so it's awesome rant about the place in general. So how did you, uh... All right. <laughs> All right. So At the same time where Jordan's getting scared shitless, <laughs> you were doing what? <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> Meanwhile, on Sly screen. Yeah. All right. Well, here, here it comes. This is a big one, and I'm not going to hold back. <laughs> I'm not oh, going to no. hold back. I'm going to throw everything that was going on. All right. So, uh -huh. we, I, I go, if you guys don't know, um, back when I used to work at the yarn factory, my hobby, other than YouTube, was to actually go every Friday when I got paid to go play laser tag. Actually. I did not know this. I did not know he that. He told me either. in the car on the right here. I, <laughs> used to, I used to play the laser tag. So this is like, something that he's kind of this like. This is a personal yeah, story here. Yeah. This, this is. This is. I, this I dates used, way back. I used to go to the laser tag religiously. Like it was like my Sunday church. It was his church. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Friday <laughs> laser tag. Friday laser tag. Try hard laser tag. And like the people there knew me and everything, and I I, I used to love it. Uh, the guns where I used to play, it was the trigger when you actually like would click it, it would shoot, and if you were to click it multiple times, it would shoot multiple times like a normal gun would do in a normal game or anything. Oh, yeah, like that. He didn't like the guns because uh, they shot right. too slow. It was like pew. No, you could you could. Pew, all right, so the pew, pre previous like laser really tag I had, they, what, what I did, it was like you had to like hold two little metal plates in front of it, and if you were to just hold the trigger, it would turn it would turn into a machine gun to those that didn't want to go constantly da 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 da, but that would obviously lower your accuracy score and end of things. But anyways, we go into this place. I'm thinking, all right, I'm gonna have fun. I I the, I seen the people. I seen so everything. I doing something competitively fun. Yeah, I, we're gonna have fun. Well, I like well, you win. competitive, competitive, competitive stuff. It's you were going in thinking that you were going to have fun, and then meanwhile, he was shitting his pants over there. In well, the yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I was in phase. I was in phase by it. Also, by the way, uh, how did you call it? Substance, whatever. That people, what, what did you say? The substances that they reeked of. All right, guys. <laughs> they reeked of substances. All right, so let me break it down to you. There was a crew of, I want to say, white kids all around their 17, 18, or around the teenager ages. All of them smell like fucking weed. All of them smell like pot, and I could smell it from fucking my house right there. It was just that ridiculous. That was the, the other crew. Did and then, too. and then there was some so more. So both crews and then, did. And then, like and then well. there was more. Uh, I, I want to say like the best way I can say it without I don't give a fuck. And right now there was a uh, ghetto looking crew. Whoa, whoa! Jesus I, Christ! I said it. Jesus I, Christ! Someone <laughs> call me a cab. I gotta get out of here. There was a ghetto looking crew. It was. <laughs> And the, the, the problem, it was like that. It was us, it 
It was the, the teenage it's us and them. It was the, the teenagers YouTube kids. crew, the ghetto crew, and then the white crew. Like, <laughs> wow. Like, oh, oh, race, race wars. wars. Race wars. But <laughs> the white kids all smell as of weed, and the majority of the ghetto crew all smell like hardcore liquor. If I were to light up a, a match in the bathroom, <laughs> they would set, they would catch on in, fire in, in, in the their house. In the words of Chris Hardwood, Hardwood, <laughs> <laughs> you would have gotten buzzed Woody off his breath. Yes. So, regardless, I, I'm, I'm like, all right, laser tag, cool, awesome. I knew everything. When you I had was, an advantage. They were all inebriated. They were either, you know, high <laughs> or drunk. You had the oh, advantage. here I, here I come, because these are, here, these are elitists. Oh. These, these are ten prestige campers. I they, they am, cheat to get the ten prestige I, though. Probably they suck mad dick. I don't fucking care. But <laughs> I have never been so upset at <laughs> anybody in the fucking world. Because, all right, I can deal with online little fucks, like little kids or whatever, that the fucking camp what if What if, like, I did the, the, the tack insert thing that I was saying? Like, if I were to I just fucking sit... I wouldn't what care. if I came in first through doing that? Would you, would you be upset? I wouldn't care. I would, I, would would make, care. I would love that. Going up and claiming that first place ticket in front of all of them. I wouldn't care. Yeah. 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 Well, let, let, me, let me keep going with this, because this gets better. So it starts... I First thing I noticed, the gun blows dick. <laughs> it, it feels like it was made for... For people that just... Man, he's gonna run this Laser place tag down. in the 90s. This, the laser quest is so bad. Like, the gun... <laughs> it, it felt like the trigger... Was I, that was, I was I was pressing a tic-tac. I was... Whoa, a, a giant tic-tac. Like, the container for it to shoot. And if you haven't hold it... If you press it a few times, it was still like... Hey, I tapped the fucking trigger three times. No, you get one. That was the delay. Bullshit. So, anytime you will go into one-on-one, -on -one, like... Uh, hit that fight first with, shot. With, with, with Kutra. Like, me and... Me and... Me and uh, Spoon went and we're fighting... And fucking when he shot me and I shot him too, like I was faster than him, but apparently the gun was stupid enough to not capture that, so we both died. I'm like, that makes no fucking yeah, that, sense. I, That's I fucking that. stupid. <laughs> and and uh, by, by the way, uh, this vest they gave us made me believe that I was having seizures or something like that. Because every time you got shot, it vibrated. I'm like, what the fuck is this? Like, all right, it makes it a little bit more realistic so you know that you died. But also, by the way, the respawn time on this shit, it was one second. So guess what? James was in front of me. <laughs> I shot him. One, turn around, shot him again. Great tactics. Great company. Also, this is the first time I ever been. You to know, there used to there was one. The laser tech that I used to go to would be if you would get shot, you'd get deactivated, yeah. and they had a hut. You would have you'd to have go to, back. You have to go to the hut and stand under it to get yep. reactivated, and it would just go. That's a good idea. That's what. That's what the one that I went the to. The one went that through. I had, it was like instead of one second, it was three. So you have some space to actually get away. So it make more sense. And and when I used to play, it was there wasn't free for all as much. There was like team battles where you had two different bases. I never. And, and anyways, this is the first time I go to a multi-level, <laughs> multi-level. Laser tag. So I'm pumped. I'm also like, multicultural. Multicultural. <laughs> a lot of cultures. <laughs> there are a lot of cultures. It was a, it was a melting of, pot of laser, laser tag. A melting a pot of substances. <laughs> I like that. I like that. That's just but, all the substances in one pot and just uh, drink it up. There you but go. But what it. I noticed is that the people that were high as fuck and the people that were drunk as fuck already had a plan in their mind. They oh, were. Yeah. They, they came had, in with a plan. They've right, been so, there before. They're veterans. Shouldn't the sober people also have a plan in their mind? When no, <laughs> because, because, no, because, have because, fun. because this laser attack was so shitty that even if you were good at it, it doesn't matter. It was whoever could camp harder. So I go to this, like, in the first floor, there was nobody. And if you found somebody in the first floor, you're stupid. Because the second floor had vents and, like, like uh, railings so you can see down. So there was this, all right, first of all, it was three people specifically in these two combined groups. <laughs> There was were two of them the two that scared the shit out no, of him. No, they, they never, they never got me. They, I never, I was never faced by them. And even just speaking of them, real quick though, I actually ran into them before he got scared shitless to him, and I, it, it wasn't racist, but the the, the ghetto people that you called them, they're ghetto. I, they I ran ghetto. into them and I said like, I seen both of them. And I said out loud. I didn't. I, I was thinking in my head, but it's one of those things where I accidentally say it out loud. <laughs> uh -huh. Like instead of th actually thinking it, I was like, "Oh shit, I don't want to get jumped here." And I walked away. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was the other way. 
Like I was thinking, I was thinking that in my head, and I didn't want to say it out loud. But I what does that mean, that. huh? Hey, what's that supposed hey, to you mean? Hey, you hungry? Come on. But I, like I said, and I was then, so busy camping, I'd come beat your ass. Then you, then you went in that same corner, and I fucking, I said before you were running up there, I was like, you don't want to go over there, because I knew what was over there, and oh, you went over there anyway, <laughs> and you shit yourself. And All that right. was it. All right, so I just saw, I just, I, I looked okay. down. <laughs> All right, His so, name so. was Leon because <laughs> I kept saying Leon. Leon, wow. Leon. Shots fired. Wait, was it Leon or Leon? Oh God. Where was the huh? emphasis at? <laughs> Leon. Leon. He, he, well, by the way, the person that was uh, that, that took our name, uh, he couldn't even write our names right on the fucking thing. No, I, I put ginger powder and I he put, put ginger out. power. I put I Scott, like, ginger I, power. I put Scotty <laughs> Pippen and he puts. <laughs> I'm like, what they the usually cut out the. I get it. I get it. But, make it shorter. but all right, here's here's the part that this is. I I was tweeting about it yesterday. I was salty as fuck. Yeah, I saw it. it was All right, so salty apparently means he's upset. I just yes. figured that out. There's yes. a lot of I was, salt. I was, I was the C right there. I, I thought was, this was a MOBA term. No, I, I it's, get, it's a stream He's term saying thing. a stream term now. It's so people like I've Alex, that who before, are the bro. number one streamers of Daisy, would know it. So. Oh, yeah. This, the, but it, we're not the it, number one streamers the stream, of Daisy. The stream, so. the stream, Twitch even has an actual icon specifically for oh, it. Oh, yeah. It's like PJ that. Salt or whatever. Yeah, PJ Salt. Um, but, all right, so there was three specific people that I want them to... I, uh, and it I, wasn't the two that we encountered. No, no. So These are three there was this, was this team white kid though. Uh, it was uh, <laughs> team kid. ghetto and one white kid. Oh, okay. <laughs> and oh. Was, all right. So how do you know they weren't the same ones that we ran into? Because I know which one. I, <laughs> let me, he knows. Let me tell Jordan's you. Jordan's reaction with all this. Team all right. White so kid. Oh. so the 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 first I'm gonna start easy with the people that didn't really bother me. It, it annoyed me a little bit, but it didn't bother me. There was this couple. It was a girl with. With like a dress and white lines on it. I did see that. And there was a uh, uh, one of the, there was a, a gentleman with it. I don't want to know. Say I don't a know gentleman. Know, a gentleman. <laughs> we'll leave it at that. I will say that it was a boyfriend. It was before a boyfriend. we get sued. It was yes. it was a boyfriend. Mm -hmm. And uh, they were both camping this on the second on the second floor. There was a little corner where you couldn't get hit from the back. And and it was just like they were just legitly not moving. And I would go there on purpose and shoot the girl and the dude and they would still remain there and anytime I would get I would pass there I, was, I got intoxicated I was drunker than I was at PAX uh, East I was drunk anytime that I would get there if a cop would come and, and breathalyze me I would go to jail because it was that bad the place reeked with alcohol the two people didn't move at all and they just they couldn't move they were just like well they were they were, they were chilly, chilly, chilly willy they were, they were they chilly moved. willy over there yeah they, they would have stood up and just they, they were just sitting it. and whatever and the dude maybe he'll move a little bit but still remained there and i don't know if they were doing tag insert actually that's the part that it really pissed maybe me off. Maybe he was Stone Cold. Maybe he was Steve Austin. And that was but, the, right, the person one. that one's name was Stone Cold. So let me let me let me give you a little bit of the layout. First floor, and then the second floor. There's two actual, I guess, second floor, and it's divided in the middle, and it's like really weird. Like the place is really big, and it, I I was lost as to no extent. But when I found a spot that I could keep shooting people and and I could see everything, I kept getting shot by somebody outside. Like where where we actually came in, and I'm like, maybe that's one of the like uh, the main people that work there that shoot you, so you actually move out of there, so you're not camping. I couldn't <laughs> find out. I, I thought that it was. I thought it was. That's that. a really elaborate thing for something <laughs> like this. Hey, was that wait. at the old place they used to go? Or no. would be like a worker. There was no second. They're like sniping you, and there was there was, pops there was up no camping in the other one that I had because it's team organized. Like if you yep. camp, you didn't. Hey, get there's anything. a good name to have. Stop camping. When you go to that thing. It would uh, cut it off, though. It'd yeah. be so, like... Stop, stop, stop paying. 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 Here comes. Yeah. Here comes the... Then here comes what really got my jollies. <laughs> really just... just really, Your Jimmy's got Russell. Yeah, they just really got me into a ruckus. So there was this bitch cunt girl. <laughs> this, this... I'm gonna call her bitch mech... Fuck you. Yep. I hate you. I hope you were never born. Because that's ex how angry I got. Yeah. Girl. So Some serious laser tag. I, I went to the spot and I thought, all oh, right, the, the people are shooting me. And I'm like, wait, there's people. There's You guys were actually going there. I saw Natalie going to there. I'm like, all right. Yeah. So I go up there the other way just because I wanted to. At this time, he was shitting his pants. Yeah, he was crying already. At the same time. <laughs> so I go, the I go time. down from the, second, from the area that I was, go down the first floor, got shot a hundred times by the same campers that were over there. And then I go <laughs> up. And I see this little, I see this, I want to say there was a chick around her 14s, 15s, and 
But mind you, mind you, this is a, uh, this is a, uh, they don't own this place. Uh, to my understanding. I think she's a little bit older than that. Oh, no, she didn't. No, I saw her face to face. No, she didn't. Like, no. <laughs> no, she wasn't. No, she wasn't a, like, I don't know. It just, it didn't seem like it. And if she wasn't, no, I don't care for it. She can burn it. She's 14 or 15. Care. They but, all seem like they were high schoolers. Well, yeah, like, well, this, let's, this little bitch cunt, uh, this, I fucking hate her. When I went to her, I started shooting her, I'm like, Get out of the, get out of that spot. Like I'm shooting him. Like, all right, you're dead. Get out of that spot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in. The spot that he's talking about is like a way that it's you an can, L. you it's walk. It's a question mark. It's like, it's a, like a hook. Mark. Yeah. Because in, at the end of the hook is like a little cubby where you can sit in. There's only one way out, and then yeah. at the end of the cubby, there's a, there's a window where you can peek out. Yeah. That's what he's. That's like so, where she was. So she was getting me when I came in already, and then I go to her, I shoot her, and she's like. Ah! Get out! And she starts pushing me with her gun. She's like, get out! This is my spot! And I'm like... Why didn't you say anything? She touched you physically. That is against the rule. Mm. Am, I, am, I, am I gonna complain? Or just well, let me, let just me, on a podcast. Is he gonna complain about this? I'd have okay. de- decked her in the face. What did you do after the game? What did you do after the game? What? You went up and talked to them. What did you say? I said, do you guys usually have these kind of people camping? <laughs> I did complain about her specifically, so your logic you goes out of the fucking window. You still complain, though. I asked if they was usually like that, and he's like, yeah, you see people camp here. Why did you even do that? Because I was confused, because this is something that happens all the time, and he's like, yeah, this tends to happen, so I'm not going to go there. By the way, there. he had an awesome voice. Yeah, he did, actually. Lunchbox. Lunchbox. <laughs> but, but, all right, I'd so, been mad so too. me and Allie go, and she had a little friend. She was a blonde chick, wasted as fuck, too, and... Now I go, Nelly, you know what? This bitch is gonna start camping, let's just camp here and start shooting her. Nelly comes and she's calling anytime Nelly would shoot her, she's like, Oh you whore! Fuck you, you whore! And I'm like, she's like, dude, she's like legitly pushing me. She's like, get out, this is my spot. I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like I legit like, what the fuck are you talking about? This is not your spot, you own the place. Get the fuck out of here. I don't see your name. I'm like, I'm like, get out, you're not me, you're not letting us have fun. I'm like, what are you talking about? You're Ruining the game, you're fucking camping in one spot like a whore! And I'm like, what are you doing? Trying to get fucking four nukes? What are you trying to do? And it just, the girl just legitly like pushed me to the point that I couldn't, I really, no joke, wanted to walk out. But the fact that you guys were playing, I'm like, I'm not gonna run it for them. But this girl legitly, ru- like, physically pushed me, and I'm like, I can't do anything. If it was a dude, I would have rocked. I'm like, fuck you! Like, what are you doing? Touch me, but she's. This entitlement of like being a girl, don't touch, 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 touch. like, all right, I'm not gonna touch you, but don't fucking touch me back and push me like I, you fucking know me, like who the think, who the fuck do you think you are? And yeah, I just, pushed Sly once and I ended up in the hospital for it. So <laughs> that's a that's a different. No, story. it just it like like I don't know her. She was acting like she run the place, and on top of that, it's like she got offensive not only towards me but towards my girlfriend. And I'm like, you're doing everything that will get you slam and like curse dump like what are you fucking doing this is like a super nice neighborhood well i don't know where you guys went though uh, yeah it was around <laughs> here okay maybe there it was a little no, sketchy it was but, a ways away. Yeah. but uh if you if you're if this girl is a fan i hope you never have watched one the of thing my was we went to dinner afterwards and he was like i went on her facebook <laughs> <laughs> And then he tasked Seamus to murder her. I know, I know her high school. I know her schedule. Guess who's gonna pay her a visit in physics class? Oh, God. That bitch is gonna know the inertia of my fist in her face. Tell you that much. Amazing. It's just like, all right, all right. I, I, I'm gonna, tell you, I'm gonna be honest. Like usually, when like even with you guys or anything, like I'm, I, I'm able to take the jokes. I'm able to like keep my temper correct and everything. But it's been a while since somebody pushed me to that limit. And like something that I really enjoy, I really enjoy laser tag. I find it really entertaining, and and it seems like one of those things. Like if you if you just rented it out for like all of us, and there was no outside yeah, parties, yeah, 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 yeah. It seems like because no, no. If you guys were camping, I would be like hit you with the back of the gun. Get the fuck out of here. Like, That's illegal. I would have reported you and get you kicked out. Yeah. Okay. Cool. But it just like I can't believe like this was like my nightmares in video games. So it's your nightmare. Imagine what he was feeling when he was high. Yeah, he ended up in the well, wrong it's a neighborhood. Well, competitive person. I'm really competitive. You know, everybody knows over here that I'm really competitive when it comes to all this shit. Hey, after everything, it was a game. Sly had, well, no, Sly didn't have fun. At the, the end rest of, the of day, us had fun. I had fun. With and Sly, then I Sly, Sly did come in fifth place. He, came he was in eighth place. No, no I, I was in eighth place. He was in fifth. Yeah, he was I was. Fifth. Out of all of us, I was the one that got the highest scores. Yep. Yeah. So and then so, I beat Sly in this crazy little hockey game. Nobody thing. gives a shit about that. To be honest, yeah, I probably would have been pretty annoyed with Sly too, because like if you have someone you don't know who's just like pushing you to be an asshole, it's kind of yeah. like, like no, the fuck are you been. thinking? Like, <laughs> like, like you just I, don't push someone. Would you around. rather have someone pushing you, or would you rather be in the wrong side? Of that? 
like, I don't know. Are, would the people on the wrong side of town be pushing me? Oh, mm. they're, they're, no. Whoa. They're just kind of like standing kind of over you. Like, just like, nah, you know. I wouldn't, I, wouldn't fa- I wouldn't be faced by that. I think kind of like if, if I would have stayed there, I'd rather have a fourteen-year-old girl pushing me than like if two I would have stood dudes. there for more than more, more than ten seconds, they probably would have jumped me. But you know what? They Get him! You know what? Though? I would have been over there like this. The first, pe- the first people that I was arguing about, the one that they were drunk and that made made that little corner smell like alcohol city. Yeah. I was laughing with them. I'm like, I would go there and they're like, Oh, you got us, and they were having fun. This girl was just like legitimately. Was she tr- drunk too? Like she was high as fuck. Why was she so like? I don't get it. This generation of kids. You know, I don't. I don't get usually, it. Usually, it's like the drunk people that are all the, like no, up they in were, arms. No, the drunk people violent. were having fun, and I was having fun with it. I thought it was really annoying what they were doing, but I'm like, you know what? You probably are the one that has scavenger, death silence, and stopping power, modern warfare too, and you Ghost. play more. You're probably that person. That's your play style. Whatever. That's my fault. But on top of that, the reason why I didn't like this, all the laser attacks that I had. They have something where, like, you have a grenade where you can, like, kind of, like, take away people from camping. This place was, yeah. like, dumb. Like, it, it, like, it promoted camping. It promoted, like, shitty This is the stuff. mainstream laser, like, tag. Fuck that. At the end of the day, did that girl beat you? I don't know. I never see her. Never seen her okay. score. But I know yeah, I got my. I, I know I got my fifth place legit. So I don't care. Yes. So we have been going for about two and a half hours on Creature Talk. <laughs> good. We hit most of that time was spent not on the topics that we had, but <laughs> that's how Creature Talk goes. Before, before, just to wrap it up, James, you had a dream that you. Oh, told us. Please, please. can <laughs> we finish on that, please? That's no, how I'm saying. Serious. James had this dream that he told us about oh, no. at dinner last night. Yeah. Okay. Well, I didn't we hear about eating. this dream. I I, no, we didn't yeah, get our food yeah, yet because I had said I said I said that it would probably gross you guys out, so I didn't want to do it. But you were like, oh, "Dan's going." I'm going. I'm going. Say bye to Dan. Go. Uh, yeah. Yes. Hey. Right, take care, Dan. Bye. Stayed as long as I could. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye. Well, hey, I want to hear this dream. Okay, here I we go. Hear this dream too. I'll have to listen to it on the creature. All right, bye. <laughs> <laughs> just go to the end. So uh, it was it was it was two days ago because uh, last yeah, night yeah, I, yeah. I had said that it was the night before. And I had said that I didn't even I didn't I didn't eat anything really like crazy two nights ago or anything like that. Okay. I just went to sleep like normal. Uh, but I had a dream, and the thing was, it was a really short dream. Like like it wasn't like you would think. Like I guess for the amount of time that I slept, that it would have been a longer dream. But it wasn't. It wasn't all that long. It, it was, was like short. a short, and then you dreamt black. Yeah, and yeah. well, no, then it was just I woke up. Oh, okay. Like I woke up at the end of it. So uh, like I and I rarely dream as is too. Like so the dream was that I like. That I, I at, at some point, I guess during the day, I had to go to the bathroom, and I had, I guess at the time, I, I had eaten something because I had diarrhea. Uh-huh. So I go in the toilet, and I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm pooping. And you're doing your thing. By yeah. the way, uh, just, just, I want, I want, because this is what's new now, can anybody listen to this animate it, or to have your, Poop. Perm- I have Poop. your permission to animate the story that you're about to say okay. if we ever see it. Can you give them permission? Well, it's a pretty short story. But even better, I mean, they can animate it. I'd rather have him being scared be animated. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, That'd be pretty that. funny. Uh, I would like to see a repost of that. a little racist here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, so yeah, I'm sitting on the toilet, uh, pooping, and uh, it's diarrhea. And I guess eventually I poop so much that it gets to the point where it starts kind of coming up to my thighs. <laughs> From like, the toilet? Yeah, from the toilet. Holy like, I guess, crap. Like, it's like, it's not like overflowing, but there's like a little puddle like in between my thighs. <laughs> That's a lot of diarrhea. That's a and lot I, of... I can feel it. It's like mixed with water. Though. You, wouldn't, yeah. you didn't even like courtesy flush or anything? No, <laughs> no, no. no. Fuck it. I don't know why. Maybe I just drifted off or something. <laughs> yeah. like, it's like t- you were, no, you're probably stung with by the amount of diarrhea. <laughs> but like, it was like, I remember, I remember like, I guess I was thinking in my head like that I could feel it, but I don't want to look at it. Like, it's just is like kind of like swooshing around my thighs and I don't want, I don't want to look like, at like, it like like, like it's and yeah it's just like moving around in my thighs I'm just like looking up and I don't I don't want to look down because I know if I look down I'll throw up and at some point I end up looking down and I start throwing up on myself and like I throw up and like there's you know the diary in the middle but the thing is like I guess the diarrhea doesn't still doesn't overflow like it still doesn't come out or anything like that it's just like that I'm barfing on top of everything, oh, and I'm just like, okay, what what the fuck is going on? And then I woke up, like I woke up at the end of that. Like I said, it was really short. I woke up, 
and my stomach hurt. <laughs> and I was like, oh I, no, I don't know. <laughs> Is this another dream within a dream? And, was like, and just so everyone knows, James hasn't gone to the bathroom for three days straight now. <laughs> oh, I'm God. holding it. I'm waiting. <laughs> he doesn't want to have it go through that. <laughs> Jesus so. Christ, you're gonna shit a rock. Uh, it was so random though. I was like, what asshole. the hell? Like, I didn't eat anything that's that crazy or anything like that to have a, a dream <laughs> like a scary that. Dream. It is. Oh, that's pretty funny. scary. No more scarier than the real life situation with Horton. <laughs> yeah, that was. I. The, so the you got us scared. You got us scared. I got pissed as fuck. Yeah. The amount of fright I went through when I came around that corner and I heard those guys calling out and I just got shot from 17 different angles. I, James is saying it exactly like it. I just kind of just let my gun down, my head down, and just walked away. They're probably shooting at him while he was going away. It's <laughs> <laughs> just like five Because it's a great idea to have a one spawn, like yeah. one second spawn. Oh, yeah, it man. fucking. <laughs> And I just walked over to James and he's laughing. <laughs> yeah, like, you, like, you get scared over there? Yeah, I was like, you get scared over there? <laughs> what happened? Oh. What'd you run into over there? <laughs> oh, man. Ran into like Detroitville in the corner. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that was that was good. Uh, that was good. Well, that's uh, so I, I said to you guys like later in the day though how I like I said that like that I said oh shit I don't want to get jumped over here like I, that was <laughs> fucking I was thinking that and I didn't want to say that but I ended up saying it I'm surprised <laughs> they didn't get offended and beat my ass for it <laughs> yeah they could have done some damage <laughs> I walked away real quick uh, well, yeah. speed walked I yeah, speed no. walked it was dark enough they didn't recognize you so they it was like when you speed walked like this <laughs> <laughs> <It's just> like, <laughs> yeah they're so running in there it's so like, it's like yeah <laughs> Bullshit, there was a kid doing 360s and shit. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah, I heard stomping, like, throughout the entire... Yeah, like, I you would hear them were. running, like, do, 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 like, running away. I don't know what the hell that was all about. Was 360 like, no-scopes for his montage. Yeah. yeah. They're, they're, like, seriously, I, GoPro. I got, I got GoPro so... GoPro next time. I got so oh, yeah. upset that it, it came to a point where I just put my, my gun on my, like, on my shoulder, and I was just shooting backwards, and I was killing people. That's how <laughs> shitty it was. I was, like, walking... Hitting mirrors and bouncing yeah, it off. Yeah, I was, like, I was people. walking backwards... Woo-hoo. And I was like, I don't, I don't care. Pew, pew, pew. And I was getting people, and I was like, this, this is stupid. The next uh, creature out in, and hopefully Seamus and Dan make it this time, because even Spoon made it this time, which is pretty rare. We're going mini golfing. Yep. Where? Uh, nice pr- across from you guys. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, we we wanted to go there. I still do want to go. Go there. somewhere like, when I come. Yeah, like fifty. Yeah, well, well we could do that. We, when when are you coming? What could we do with Z? Right. Go after to the mountains. Leave. We go to the zoo with Z. In the mountains, the zoo. The zoo in the the summer is like the worst thing ever for me, at least. Yeah, smells like ass. I'm talking about just the zoo in the summer. Like it's hot. You're walking around watching a bunch of animals be hot. (laughs) They're just sitting there like all (laughs) sleepy because they're hot. Yeah, yeah. It's like damn. I wish I was a tiger. In Germany, when we went to the Germany, like it's fucking 95. I wish I could just go to sleep under that tree. (laughs) Even a fucking alligator was like, (laughs) (laughs) turn on the AC, please. Poor thing. Uh, Well, anything else, Z? Do you have any interesting stories? Pickles. Okay, there you go. There you, go. That's great. Yeah, you heard it first from Z. Nobody else said interesting it well, talk. but Z. We ripped on Nintendo. Gave our impressions on Nintendo. We talked about laser tag and a bunch of other topics. Yeah. Uh, we talked good. about Amy Kitchen Dick Nightmares. <laughs> Slightly <laughs> racist once again. Yeah. We seem to tread there off. Quite a bit. <laughs> blame it on blame it on me. Blame it on the fact that we I'm are a multicultural well, yeah, group are, here. Yeah. Okay, we've got a Canadian, we've got a half Puerto Rican, a Puerto Rican, an Irishman, a white British person, as well. a Dan, a Dan, a Dan. <laughs> We're gonna slide, a Dan. We have a Dan, and we have a mountain man, which is Spoon, <laughs> which is Spoon. Yeah, he's Grizzly Adams, yep. oh, Jeremiah God. Johnson. I'm By also the way, British. Uh, I'm the Scottish. I'm that, gonna, right? We should go to the other laser tag in Fun City. We're not gonna do. I'm not. That gonna, one actually is. Yeah. Well. That one's smaller. It, it is. Seems, it's really. Yeah, small. but you know what? Ugh. Having two floors, it doesn't make sense. I'd much rather go there though because they have other stuff. So, yeah. Like, yeah. If we should do the laser like course. Like the, the they have a bunch of lasers and you like try and jump through them in the least amount of time with hitting the le- the least amount of lasers. Where is that? It's at Fun City. Sounds Get the infuriating. fuck out of here. That sounds legit. It'd be pretty. That no, it's, like, it's like Mission Impossible. Yeah, I was about to thing. say. Like, sounds like I keep mm-hmm. hitting them and just be. Hey, we should get a go- get We should get a GoPro yeah. for that shit. That's for like- terrible. That's a terrible. Oh, it will fuck me in the asshole. 